actually on time and then something went wrong with OBS and it wasn't even something serious. It was just like, ah, oh, we fucked it up that time. Try again. And then I try again and it worked. You just had to put me off my timing, didn't you? Goddamn son of a bitch. Someday I'll get it. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Tomorrow I'll get it. That's a good one. <laughs> no, God damn it. Thank you. Hello, Ben. That was pretty quick. Give me your money. Give me your bits. Hand them over. Uh, fat clit. Give me your bits. Amber, I thought what you said in the Discord was very, uh, very, uh, unsensitive. Insensitive? I got the word. Um, what'd you say? She said something. Oh. Oh no, wait a minute. Sorry, I'm calling it the wrong person. I'm reading it now. It was Elida that said it. Um, I guess I'll wait for her to show up to call her out. Thought it was Amber. Was it Amber? Also, I want to test this real quick. Um, you guys can hear like awkward fan noise, right? But you can also hear me pretty well. As you're on, you're okay. You're 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 good. Why is there so many yes? Um, can, can I still be heard relatively well and the static still be heard? Or or is it just not worth it? Why did the music stop at that time too? Uh, music was just changing songs. Can I still be heard relatively well or is it just, that's pretty quiet. Okay then. Let's do that and leave it at that. Enjoy fat. I've heard it's soothing to some people. Oh, wait a minute. Mum sent me a text saying she has a new sweet to try. I must try this. I was lied to. It was it was a it was a lie. I've tried them. It's just chocolate. It's, it's not even a sweet. It was her Christmas present. From not from me. From oh.
It's it's chocolate with I think caramel in the middle, <clears throat> and it's like fancy chocolate. So, uh, so you know, you buy a packet for like twenty euro, and you get like ten pieces of chocolate. It's the best. This is like super fancy stuff. Um, and I had to go that time because the dogs broke into the room. And they can be awkward when they break in. Sam just plants himself on the bed and he guards it. Suddenly I'm no longer Michael, I'm Invader. Um, but it was handled. He, he got a poke in the eye today. Right there, he was sitting on the couch. So we might not see him on the couch today because... Um, because he might be like, if I sit on the couch, I might get poked in the eye. It wasn't by me, though. It was mum. She was doing VR. And we were testing Fuck out... Right in pussy. Inappropriate, Shannon. We were testing out... The VR has a mode where you don't use the controllers and you just... It, like, tracks your hands, which is really cool. So mum was doing a thing and she was, like, pointing at stuff. And then Sam was sitting next to her. And she poked him right in the eye. Um... But he's fine. He he had a moment, and we were like, "Oh, poor dog!" And he was like, "Yeah, I am a poor dog." And then he got a treat, and he was fine. But maybe he remembers. Also, hi Niall, hi Shen. Poor pupper, indeed. Let's uh, let's eat some of this chocolate. It's a very small amount of caramel. But it's nice chocolate. Well, I didn't apologize to him. I was just like, oh, poor dog. I made a big fuss and, like, rushed him into the kitchen. Just because that gets his brain off of it. Is that a Fredo? That's what it tastes like, now that you say that. But I don't know what it is. It's just chocolate. It's like fancy chocolate that mum had. But the chocolate does taste like a Freddo. It's like a... It's a, uh, an upper class Freddo. A Fred, if you will. Have you done all your assignments yet now? And how did your timetable look? Freddy. Fred. Fred. Why is he called Fred O? That's a good point. Why isn't he called Freddy? Is he like Alfredo? Or is it something to do with him being a frog? You need to do the technical writing. Come on, help me. Fuck off. I'm done with that. What technical writing? I don't know what you're talking about. But I'm not going to help you. I got my assignments done barely. Pepe chocolate. Now that's, that's high class. Oh. You still have to do your essay? I had that finished ages ago. Actually, over a month ago. I think. I think it was a month ago that the deadline was, and I had it done like a week before the deadline. It's probably shit, but it's good enough to get me a pass. And what, you're struggling to type it up? Or are you still actually writing the essay? flex on the guy it's it's a whole essay that's or it's a whole module that's about writing one essay i just got it done early and like i said it's not good but it should be enough to get me a pass brain won't work just what do you write in your zone i think you've told me before but that was like way at the start of the semester A couple of the lads in my course wrote about cloning, which was pretty cool. Chocolate. 
Chocolate's all gone. Well, it's still some in my mouth, but for the most part, chocolate's all gone. What was that noise? I heard like breathing. Oh, also we need to figure out a, uh, a new a new bit goal. The effect of energy poverty on the development of human quality of living. I don't think you have told me that actually. What was the prompt again? Um, in trying times, something like that. More Nancy. No, Nancy's a sub goal. That's the next sub goal is Nancy Drew. Times of poverty ahead is a lack for the label. <clears throat> Clean. That's a pretty good one. So are you going back to like, like recession and like seeing what effects that had and shit like that? Like are, are, how many, how many past examples are you pulling from? You should get the free Nancy game though now though, so you're prepared. Hmm. I could, or I could make you guys buy it for me at the time and like punish you guys for making me play more Nancy. You'll be fine though. Did you have a draft done? Doing it in sub -Sahara, Saharan Africa. For little blue people. I think that's PG. Have no money? Well, no Nancy then. It's going to be ages off anyway. Excuse me. We won't be playing Nancy Drew again till like October probably. Play games? We'll play Zero Escape soon. I don't know how close we are to beating this thing. <laughs> I mean, we could play Nancy Drew sooner, but that involves hitting this sub goal, so that's 15 more subs. And then the next sub goal, which will be the Nancy Drew, which probably 25 more. So what? That's 30, 40 subs? 15, 25, 40 subs. That's a ways off. Can we get a Minecraft stream? Um. Maybe. Maybe someday. That'd be fun. I could fuck around in Minecraft. Especially if it was on, like, a server. But I don't think I even have it installed right now. Also, I did have my Minecraft name is, I think, Orbiter Big Gay, so... That'll need some explaining. We need to... We need a bit goal. I'll set up a server, sure. Yeah. You do that, I'll play. How's your how's your semester looking? Will you be fit to attend class? I imagine you will. Name can be changed, bro. Can it? For free? I thought you'd have to, like, like uh, Xbox, Microsoft style, you have to pay like a tenner to change your name. I just assume that. I think I had I had an account and then I forgot the password to it so I just bought a new account because I was lazy. Free charge. Oh okay. I might do that then. Um what to change it to though. I'll think of something. I have, to, I, I have to, somebody remind me, maybe like tomorrow, to talk to Shannon about the art stream. Because I'm going to need her input on it. It's like two weeks off still. My timetable kind of sucks. But uh, Friday's early enough, so. Probably won't be too many Thursday streams this semester. Yay, art. You, you, you forgot the quotations around art. It's a, it's a, it's a stretch to call, to refer to it. Mine hella sucks. You've seen mine. 
you know mine. Saying it's hella, hella sucky is giving it a bit too much than it deserves, I think. That shit doo doo. Oops. That shit major doo doo. Do do poopy pants, if I if I may say so myself. That should do it. Oh, all right. Well, for so for whatever reason, that hurt more. Mine's is. I, I'm not in half nine every day, which is nice. I actually have some, I wouldn't say mornings off. I have like an hour on Monday and then two hours on like Wednesday, I think. Any art is art. Uh, you're, you're wrong there. Anyone can make art. Mm. Nah. I mean, yeah, but when it comes, I, I, you're actually, I agree with that. Just not drawing art. I've seen far worse than you. You at least have a lot of, have lots of creativity. I don't think so. I just, I wouldn't say creativity. I'm good at winging it. Uh, it will be art to us. Yeah, see, see, my way of art will be the whole... Oh, actually, this is a good place. This is a good angle for the art, man. Because if I can get it to sit here, I can actually draw on it. Wow, big brain. We'll sort that out in the oh, future. Katie's here, and, and she's, she's looking, looking kind of sus. sus. That's a... It doesn't look like a light is going to come, so uh, I'm going to have to just call her out without her being here. Uh, her Discord comment of saying it's been a fat minute since since she played Among Us. That's offensive. All right. Uh, it is a big boned minute. Please and thank you. Uh, it's a hot minute. Well, we know what what Amber's into. Uh, you're a DM, DM, Michael. Of course, you have creativity. Yeah, but again. See, I'm, I'm good in that, like, you could say that's my art, but creativity when it comes to drawing on paper and making thing that look good, mm-mm. I make funnies, I, I do the game, and the game go, oh, thing happened, and I go, oh, that thing funny, and some fucking pretentious bastard will go, that's art right there, he has created art and i'll be like yeah okay i'll give it to you that make that make me happy um it's there you just gotta find it we'll try to find that together then um you know what's one thing i want to do i want to do a card opening stream just like like a like a pokemon card opening i think it would be fun and i think pokemon cards look cool i've never uh, I don't think I've ever owned any and I wouldn't know what's valuable but that could be that could be the next bit goal you guys could probably pay for it actually the bit let's look at let's look this up together well not together I don't want you to look at my screen <laughs> get off my screen you bastards How much is a booster box if we just got like one of those, that would probably do a stream, right? It's just technical stuff, you can learn that. Creativity is the important part. You could do combo art and Pokemon cards, like draw the cards as you open them. <laughs> that would be really funny, actually. <laughs> Maybe, that would be pretty good. Uh, that would be really bad, but that's pretty funny. Let's see how expensive this shit is. God damn. I 
that's expensive. Give me like a cheap one. I don't even, I don't even know where to buy these things. Make Ben guess the Pokemon from Ben from Michael's drawings alone. So I would pull the card, attempt to draw it, and then you guys have to guess, and then I show the card. Uh, on the terms of art, have you seen the art on the Discord? Have. Well, I think so. The like D and D inspired stuff. That shit's good though. That's the shit that I look at and go, see, someone can call that art, and I wouldn't call them a liar. get a 360 fake booster card in packs from China. What do you mean? What do you mean 360? Like three, 360 packets of boosters? If they look anything like the, the actual versions, I'd go for that because I don't really give a shit. Um, I actually have some packets of like fake Yu-Gi-Oh cards that I got in Portugal. 360 cards. Oh, okay. <laughs> Um, I got like the Yu-Gi-Oh like fake things. Obviously, I didn't think they were fake at the time. Um, and then I like came home and was like, "Oh, I'm gonna give these to like so many people." And then I like looked at them and they was like really obviously fake. And I was like, "And maybe I won't." What is this, AliExpress? Maybe. Let me bookmark that. Yeah. Check that out. I'll check this out in my own time. Whatever. We'll uh we'll we'll figure out the uh the next goal. Oh, and we need to name plant. That's another thing. Um, I'll do that tomorrow. Why did why did that break everything? What's it, what's occurred here? Okay, this should work. Oh. Why is that the wrong size? It keeps minimizing it. It doesn't usually do that, but whatever. Keeps it on screen for you guys, so who cares? All right, let's finally, let's stop stalling and finally get into the game. I'll chat, that's actually a pretty fun idea. Good one, Amber. But would you guys rather, I mean, the original tasteful art stream idea was I attempt to draw hentai, but make it PG. Um. So what would you guys prefer, or would you want both? Would you want the next bit goal to be tasteful Pokemon art stream? Both? Alright. I'll think about that. Until then, let's, uh, let's solve some mysteries, guys. What's going on here? Oh, you guys really want both? I'm sure, uh, that's kind of loud. I'm sure Ben and Hootie will be on board because it's Pokemon. Um, none of them are Pokemon card experts there, so. Maybe we get the bootleg ones and I'll like check them out. 300, yeah, probably just do the bootleg ones. Don't tell anyone though, that's between us. Okay, you shut the fuck. They don't need to know. That's a good idea. Niall, good job there. Uh, what was the last thing that happened? How do I flow?
Okay, we did most of these. We really went down a route here. Oh yeah, that was the whole root beer thing. Um... And then didn't we go down a route here somewhere? And now we're going, we're going with Luna. We're journeying about with, with Luna. Niall, do you know this game? This game is very, very heavy on the visual novel. Sure. All right. Then it's good though. I will go with Alex. It's not amazing, but it's good. As long as I get to. And it has big boobies. Fine. I don't have any objections. For no we'll reason. Going through the yellow door, I was right? checking out the next game, the third game, and there's one character the whose boobs just bust out of her yeah, shirt. Stuck with a kid and some old fart. I can't see how this could possibly go badly. Hmm. Well, maybe we'll get so lucky that's interesting. I'm excited to get to that. What did you just say? Ten seconds remain until chromatic doors close. Nine. Eight, seven. But I really have no idea what's going hurry. on in this game. It's still no clue who K is. Three, two, one, zero. Oh, Elida's playing Stardew Pro Valley. It's over this Close. way. Close. And you get, oh, Ben's playing Stardew Valley. Couple goals. Hashtag. Hashtag ball and chain. Hashtag loser. Uh, hashtag who they gonna marry though? Ben's got a hankering for that purple haired one. I can't remember her name. Abigail, I remember her name. Oh right, we're doing the lounge. Didn't you see the door? It said lounge. It said this is the lounge. Well, there doesn't seem to be much dust. Stardew Valley, yeah. Is. That's my sister's name, and that confused me. Purple-haired girl. You guys have both played Stardew Valley, haven't you? That's that's Pierre's daughter. You can fuck her in a cave. Beats me. Which, of course, it I looks did. Looks like there are four doors in here. Yeah, the one we came in. The one opposite it. I don't and know characters at all. Right. If you've not played Stardew Valley properly. Plates, though. Don't think we'll be opening them anytime soon. Gamer girl. Yeah. The one who eats amethyst rock. I didn't see any other one of the things she loves is, is amethyst. Maybe amethyst? Amethyst? The purple rock. There's purple hair. And you give it to her and she goes, yum, that was tasty. And you never give her another one because you value her teeth. She only eats silver rock? No, she eats amethyst as well. Garbage, okay. She loves purple rock, but she eats silver rock. She eat purple rock, you dumb bitch. Banana hanger. I've never even heard of a banana hanger. I don't think I can be friends with someone who spends money and space on a banana hanger. You just throw them on top of the other fruit. Maybe I don't, Shannon. You don't know that. Do you see a southern hemisphere? Oh, yeah. What's this? 
Looks like a page from a journal. Bartender's diary. Oh, God. There we go. Rich people have them. Yeah. I figured. So, Shannon. Probably has it next to her AirPods case. 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 So that her dog doesn't chew through the case for the case. <laughs> okay. Glad we have a globe now. Bananas make others... What? Banana make other four to hair more quickly. How are you supposed to keep them separately? What are you saying? You okay, Davey? Having a stroke? You need to hang your bananas because they have chemicals in them that make them continuously ripen non-stop. And if you put them in with the rest of the fruit, they will over-ripen the rest of the fruit and ruin them. And yes, I do have a banana. I knew it. For rich bitch. <sighs> Cost me five euro. It's not about how much money it costs you. It's about how much of your pride. Make other fruit. Bananas make other fruit ripen, I guess, more quickly. I, I still don't understand. <laughs> make other fruit here more quickly. How are you supposed to keep them separately? We just have them on top of the other fruit. They don't make them ripen that fast, I don't think. I mean, we eat them fast enough, and then the birds get what we don't eat. I probably have to look at this bartender's journal. No, not that. Three customers came in today, a couple and their son. The father sat in the center with the mother on the left and the son on the right. When I came to take their order, they said the following. My wife likes the color red and I like white. Oh, God. What the other person said, what Shannon said. Uh, now you're just storing the bananas room. You keep bananas separate. No, we don't. I mean, I think right now they might be in a little plastic bag. If that helps. I'm not rich. You just store your bananas incorrectly. We save space. Um, and yes, you are. Again, you have a case for your AirPods case. It... Awful. Uh, my son has loved the color blue ever since he was a child. My husband likes island and I like planet. My mother and I like moon, my father likes anything green. One of them was a liar, but I swiftly made their drinks and handed them over. What? Okay, so, wait, let's look at these. So these are the colors. These, can I, I, can I pick any of these? All right, Luna. Did she just punch me? them in a plastic all right and then stamp on them bananas are tasty good sir i didn't buy the airpods i'm broke as shit okay you're just privily i'm sorry uh you have to store bananas separately like i just end up with different piles what i'm done with this conversation put the just just fruit bowl fruit bowl all the fruit goes in the fruit bowl and then you just eat the fruit. Chemicals and whatnot, whatever. All right, how does so many people know about this chemical shit? Oh God, I can pick all of these up. All right, oh, Jesus. Okay, so we've got color and we've got names. My wife likes the color red and I like white. My son has always liked ocean. Surely the son's lying then. Or is the mother? My son loved the color blue ever since he was a boy in my home. Yeah, because the mother, the mother and the father 
gives all the details. So red, one red, one white, one blue. Let's just try that. Cannot combine these items. Do I have to put the glasses? Do I use the needles to open them? No, bananas ruin fruit. Banana don't go in food bowls, though. I will send you guys a picture. Because they make the fruit ripen faster? My, the bananas are literally sitting on top of, like, the apples and pears we have. And possibly oranges. Do I have to put these down? So the glass that the alcohol is in goes right. Details, details. Nobody's going to try and pick you up if you've been so anal. Wow, they said the word anal. That's not PG. You guys just need to eat fruit faster. And you guys need to organize your space better. this with anything? Do I have to put this in? F Do I have to put this one in first? Can I combine these items? Right, Jesus Christ. Keep your bananas in a banana hammock separate from the plums. I think you're having a stroke. What's a banana hammock again? Okay, normal fruit does not ripen after they're picked off the trees. They have to ripen before that, so you buy them when they are ripe, right? You're saying too many R words. Like, there's, <laughs> whatever, I'm not explaining it. Stop talking about bananas. Somebody help me solve this. Why can't I combine? Do I need something else? Oh, idiot. Yeah, yeah. Okay, what am I putting in this? Red, let's just start with red. Well, wife likes red and she wants planet. So let's do red. No, no. Red. Planet. Bananas are picked before they ripe, so they contain the chemical that allow them to ripen. Once picked, so you buy them before they ripe, and they ripen themselves. Why do you know so much about bananas, Shannon? What has this got to do with veterinary? The mother on the left, and the son on the right. Okay. Mother here. Unless they're backwards because he was on the inside. I would assume he's talking about from the dad's perspective, but maybe he's talking about the the bartender's perspective. No, no. Stop picking it up. There we go. So you got from the son, the father's side in the center with the mother on the left, father on the right. Why do you know so little about bananas? Because all you need to know about bananas is how to open them and how to eat them and that they go very nicely with peanut butter. That's it. You don't need to know anything more about bananas. It's a common fact that you learn into, well I didn't do junior sir biology. So I have bananas and I know this stuff. I have bananas and I don't know this stuff. Which person's lying? I'm assuming the son's lying because otherwise you don't have all the facts. Because if, if someone else is lying, then you don't know what color or what what word the sun likes. Um, so what's the next one? White. White Island. 
white. Island. No one taught me about this. Wow. This is a father, so he's in the middle. Give me and give. No. Give me. And then, oops, finally we have the sun. Sun likes ocean blue. Michael, you did do junior cert biology, it's compulsory. No, I pretty much ignored anything outside of physics. So I'm pretty sure for the junior cert, I got like just about 40% because I nailed the physics section and then I just kind of winged the, uh, the biology and chemistry parts. Uh, I remember doing pretty badly in, in junior cert science, but being like, it's fine, I nailed physics. Or I assume I nailed physics, because I don't think you can see your results. Um, and then I went on to do okay in physics. I probably just backwards. Gimme. Short. And short. There we go. Wait, did I get the secret? Okay, how did I get the secret one? Yeah, yeah, we know this. Moon, sun, moon. My knowledge of physics is just what the doctor says in the episode School Reunion. What? Oh, as in Doctor Who, okay. I thought you were talking about just some random doctor. Physics, physics, physics? That's, I mean, you've got the gist of it. Um, just add some, some, you know, weird speed facts, like a feather is falling at whatever speed and a train is blazing by. How fast will the train lift the feather? And uh, you've got it. Also facts about the moon. I think you need to know, like, the distance between the Earth and the Moon off the top of your head, which is pretty bull. And you need to know to not copy off Patty Costello, because I've heard that anybody that did that, which was a surprising amount of people, uh, failed that subject. And, uh, I don't know why you'd copy off that guy, because he missed the last three months of school. Um, I did chemistry in high school because I didn't want to deal with physics. What's heavier, a kilogram of feathers or a kilogram of steel? They're both a kilogram. Um, I think. I think there's actually a difference between them, but I don't remember it. Um, I did physics just because it's math and it's handy for coding. Which, it's, it's handy. My next, I have a module this semester that's a uh, math and physics based, so I'm hoping it's just more math because that'll be easy uh, but it seems like it's going to be my new Unity pro or Unity module this stuff's all stuff we already know kilogram of steel because steel Getting done with math. I hate math. Alright. Well. We're playing this game. This game is like 90%. Well, at least the original one was like 90% math. How did I mess this up?
I've seen you add incorrectly plenty of times, but I've refused to point it out because I don't want to be a snobby prick. But during Spyro, I decided to lean into that snobby prickness. And, and, and your error wasn't bad, you were just a hundred off. My son loves blue. Ever since he was a child, my husband likes island and planet. But then the son says my mother and I... It has to be the sun. The sun's... Maybe the sun wasn't the liar. The sun has to be the liar because we don't have... There's six bits of info we need. The three colors and the three words. The father and the mother gives us six bits of info that don't overlap with each other. Whereas the sun overlaps with everyone, doesn't he? Um, yeah, because... Because the dad says that the son likes ocean, whereas the son says he likes moon. The mother says that uh, she likes planet, whereas the son says she likes moon. How's it? How's it? Now? Swiftly made their drinks and handed them over. Set the phone. Father likes anything green. I don't mind math, I just haven't had to do it in like four years. Lucky. Kitty, what have I done wrong here? Son likes blue, because then you, if the, if the dad's the liar, then we don't know what color the mother likes. Right? I once considered majoring in math in high school, and then later considered minoring, and ah, so glad I decided no. Um, yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't push my math any farther because algebra is pretty tough and some of the stuff in leaving cert was pretty over my head um, And in this course we have to deal with matrices and stuff and that's just like it's like a formula that's the size of a book so um, I, It's tough, but that's also one of the easiest modules I've done what do the two needles do? I think the piece of out might be some sort of needle. specific time, then press the check button. Oh, okay. Why flex red planet? Red. Whoops. Oh, goddammit. No, this way. What 
go to White Island. Is that wrong? Is that wrong? Try Green Island. What the hell? Come huh. I can hear Mum eating something, so they're they're whinging wanting in. I love the color blue. Where'd you even get green from, Shannon? Oh, because the dad liked anything green. Might be missing something. Blue moon, maybe? This puzzle was so close to being, or this puzzle room was so close to being really easy. And somehow the easy solution was the secret answer. Is there another note somewhere that I'm missing? That must be it. Here we go. Astronomy today. 450. Okay, here we go. Green Sun. Black letters spell out red moon. What does that mean, though? Blue planet. Oh, I can't spin it. Okay, red moon. What was the other one we had? Red moon, blue planet. Green sun. There we go. Uh, green... Sun. Oh, whoops, I forgot to put the glass on. Come on, put the glass in there, you goob. All you have to do is attach two balls, put a glass in this but yeah, put the oh wait, I have to dump it.
Also, it's a real shame that Cutie missed the, uh, the physics conversation. He would have loved that. Especially with his physics he did last night. Sorry about the internet cutting out last night. That went out in, like, the whole area, so... It really put a downer on the rest of the night. Cut, cut, no. Um, blue planet. Oops. Sun, ocean, island, planet. What order do we put this in, though? Red Moon was the last one, wasn't it? Red Moon. Could have just been in any order. Sun, moon, star. There we go. Sun, moon, star. Oh, I've forgotten it. Fuck. I remember that it's sun, moon, star, but I forgot the placement. I think it's this. one off. There we go. Easy. Thank you, Shannon. Why is Niall sending a video? Niall, if you're still in the chat, I'll check that video f long later. A B time. God, Sam's throwing a real fit now. Once they start actually talking and I can skip, I'm gonna go sort out the dogs. What are we thinking about doing with that uh, with Luna? Are we gonna ally or betray? Yeah. Okay. They're just explaining all this stuff again. Gonna skip these terrible, terrible puns. Sorry, Elida, if you're here. And the key! We ha- we has key. So you know how to unlock a lock. Thanks, Fly. Bitch, you got one bitch that knows how to speak Latin, and suddenly she's the genius among idiots. What's she talking about lunar eclipses for? Where did this come from? Ally Luna, ally, comma. Luna always allies, doesn't she? She does. And I kind of agree with that. But knowing our luck, that will be when she betrays. Weird, so if I just decided to give some weird lunar eclipse fact. You know why? It's because we're on the goddamn moon. I'm telling you. We're on the moon. Gotta do both anyway. Yeah, maybe, maybe betraying Luna will lead us to the true ending, and we don't have to ally with her. Okay, I can hold on it. Do you think it works? Yeah. Hey, someone's coming. Dio Quark in 
Tenmyoji. We ran into them a little bit ago. Well, not literally, of course. I don't know. With a prowl yeah. like that, I imagine you run into a lot of things. Let me see the map. found in the infirmary. Oh, we found a map like that too. At least Ours three of those teas board. are just hot chocolate. How do you have chocolate? White chocolate peppermint. White hmm. chocolate mocha. Maybe we should sit down for a bit and exchange information. Isn't mocha a coffee? No. There's plenty of time for that after we check out Lavender the cream. That could pass as a tea. Caramel truffles and other hot chocolate. It sounds like chocolate. They all sound like chocolate. Three of them sound like chocolate. Do you guys just call anything tea? Eh. <laughs> what the? Oh, this is just like the other. Probably herbal if they've got white These doors have colors chocolate on too. in it. The one on the left is green. The one in the middle is well, green. Well, Ben really fucking dropped Stardew Valley just red. to call her at. Are these chromatic doors? Look, ben, you're drinking decaf. I'm pretty sure there's a place for you in tea hell. <laughs> Lavender, I would believe, is herbal. But does, just like the does truffle count as herbal? They're trying to force it open, I suppose. Is something wrong, Alice? You've been staring at your bracelet. Wait, Mocha, is it? Oh. No, I'm fine. But it looks like my guess was right. The numbers How crazy changed. would it be if Alice or Clover betray each other? Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Telling me we're gonna have to just sit around here for another two hours? Hmm. Looks like we don't have a choice then. We gotta head back. Quark, why don't you show them that note we found? <laughs> sure. Oh? Did it say something like supplementary rules? Call him out. Say something about Liverpool. That'll get him back. We found ours in the Nah, he'll probably just agree with you actually. No, no, I'm not listening to this again. So, this is the lounge. It would seem Zero's notes were telling the truth. Getting back here was easy enough. I, I have no stance on these that teas. Means we could all go visit Pretty sure most of my households have lions. The crew quarters. Or my family hey, households. Grandpa, check this out. But Some of your favorite I wouldn't be able to tell them apart. Oh, oh. Do they actually taste different? Actually, uh, tempting. I don't really think now's the time. Like, could I give you two cups of tea, and would you be able to identify which is which? Or had they always been close? Yeah, we know this. We know that they're grandpa and child. Well, adoptive grandpa. In other words, they'd known each other before the nonary game, and if Quark was calling Tenmyoji Grandpa, maybe they were related. Fuck you, Shannon. COVID wouldn't have affected you anyways because you clearly lost your taste years ago. Wow, he he really thought that one. Did you spit that? Did you spitball that one with with Let's Elida? Go, as soon as we get out of here, I can drink all the scotch I want. 
you can drink all the food coming from you Barry's drinking twink. What? Jesus, guys. I don't have a mod here, here to hopes, to break this up. But so I'm just going to sit back and enjoy it. sure? Do you have enough money? Oh, ye of little faith. I found an old factory full of rare earth metals the other day. Rare earth metals? You know why he has to clarify that they're earth metals? Because we're on the moon. Amber loves the chaos, it seems. It'll get bloody if I let it, so I may have to break it up at some point. Lions is better, not only does it have a stronger, better taste, the pyramid shaped bag allows for ultimate disper optimal dispersion. Should have been ultimate dispersion. Can I skip this now? Yeah. That's definitely Oh the old lady's dead and this timeline as well. The infirmary. Okay. Okay, wait a minute. Hold up. The only timeline in which the old lady didn't die is the one with Alice. Alice must have killed that bitch. Get out of here with your square flag tea bags. Shannon hates anything flat. She might be old, but she's still a woman. If we're going to do an autopsy. Let's get this. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes, I remember. Oh yeah? And just how the hell do you Notice remember that? Sam will go on to the couch because again. Alice Clover and I examined this entire room. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. Yes. I think I should be able to manage that. Fuck oh, face, Jesus Christ. Old lady dead. We don't know who did it. She was in room. He's growling at it. Maybe they should have thought about what went into the tea bag. What's different? Chef. Up here. Did she climb onto the roof? Why? What is she doing up there? Glad I decided to have coffee today. Coffee's awful. Seriously? Unless it's iced That's coffee. That's the best you can do? I was expecting something about how I jump at the first sign of trouble. But he's already gone into the A B rooms. It is iced well, coffee. Well, there was something I wanted to nice check one. out. Coffee is awful, but not iced coffee. I can bear this iced thing. coffee. Remember it? Try opening it. Aloha, Connor. Nice if one of my mm. VIPs to show up. Then that means this A B room is locked down tight. Actually, Connor, you're a coffee yeah. drinker now, too. Connor, Ipant, Connor, Ipant. Ipant, uh... Yeah. I still think it's K. No. What do you guys think? Okay. Theory time. Quick theory time. The only timeline in which the old lady didn't die is the one in which we spent our entire time with Alice. So, uh... Do you guys think Alice did it? I think Alice did it. Coffee's too strong for me. I don't like this smell. It is pretty strong. I know. I just wanted to be sure. Alright, it seems Five no dog hutch tonight. 
until Ambidex. Let's go. I imagine coffee Ambidex smells amazing. No, I'll agree with Chen in there. Coffee doesn't smell that good. You guys got a split second a dog. I wouldn't put it past Alice to just fucking murder an old lady. I agree. Look, there's something on the screen. You know what, Connor? I'll let Connor decide because he's here. We get the choice. There's this nice, pretty lady that uh, is probably going to ally with us here. We get the choice on whether to ally with her or not. Ally or betray her. What are you feeling, Connor? I used to not like coffee, and then now I love it. I'm pretty sure that's everyone I know's relationship with coffee. Astute observation. Everybody's everybody starts off hating coffee and then just someday they go let me try coffee again And then I talk to them a month later, and they're like Cappuccinos mochas uh, the little shot coffees. I love them especially when they've got skimmed milk And I go whoa, okay stay away from me crackhead Ally for plot, okay Fido paired up with Mooney and went through the magenta door, didn't they? Forgot cold brew. That means that Siggy and Fido... Is cold brew what, what iced coffee is tagged and under? The other way too. Cold brew is so good. I have a friend who's drank black coffee since she was like seven. That Obviously, friend is that crazy. What? Why have I gotten snaps from the ladies? Tell me only... I guess enemy isn't really the right word, is it? That white chocolate mocha right there, that's just hot chocolate. chocolate. Then they're your ally. Oh, what? I accidentally opened Niles' don't video. Well, don't worry. Just listen while Zero the Third explains it all. <laughs> First, I want everybody to go Okay, I gotta be careful because <laughs> Niles might just scream something offensive. You should see A. Was that an accident, Shannon? Because that made no sense. No, iced coffee equals coffee that was hot and is now not. Cold brew is cold the whole time. I sent you a snap by accident, I think. That was for Amber. Ah, okay, that makes sense then. We can mostly ignore what this guy's saying because it's all... Retreading. No, I won't wait, and I can't wait. Didn't you hear me? It is time. One minute remains until Abadex game polling closes. You see, it's time for me to be hopping on out of here. See you later. They annoy the fuck out of me. Nice trouble. Now, there's your wish. We don't have time to talk about this. Choose betray. Jesus Christ, Fi. We don't know if she'll ally or not. No, we're pretty certain. If She's allied like ally, every other time. Betray, I don't think I've ever seen her betray. Two points. You tell me, Sigma. What's three minus two? Sigma what, bro? Just come visit and we can drink so much tea and coffee. That's not a reason to visit. Exactly. If our BP gets down to one, it's over. So? Thirty seconds remain until Ambidex game polling. And you're not including hot chocolate in that. Tea and Just coffee and hot point. chocolate. Come on, inclusion, Amber. Jesus. There we go. What are you saying, Connor? I miss BAM coffee places. I've been buying Tony's out. I don't know what you're talking. Put hot cocoa in the coffee. No, why would you ruin such a good thing like that? Tony's is so good. 
All right, you goddamn American. Fine. If you Women. want to, then I. I resubbed. Did I miss that? It didn't give a, an alert, but I see that you now have the thing. Well, thank you. I see you now once again have your like first sub or whatever it is. I have spicy hot chocolate mix that I've been meaning to mix. All right, why are you mixing it with coffee? Spicy hot chocolate sounds weird and cool. I like it. Also resubbed and it didn't send an alert. Hmm. I think you guys have to send a message. You can like announce that you resubbed or you can quietly resub. Um, when your BP hit zero, you die. I don't know how many months you guys have subscribed for because you just didn't announce it. So, thanks. Connor, are we still allying? Give me the option to share that it's my second anniversary or something, but I didn't bother. Okay, that that's how you announce it. I see. Look at you guys subtly doing it without wanting any praise, and then coming out and asking for praise. Uh, ally, let's do it. Round one of the Ambidex game. I hate every conversation we've had tonight. Bananas, tea, and coffee. Will be displayed in the warehouse. I subbed for February and March. Thank you Ooh. for your participation. Well, be sure to announce it when it gets re when it gets redone. Now open. If Luna betrays, no one our luck probably will. I think everybody's betrayed us in the first part that we've tried to ally with, and when we betray them, they ally with us. As Fi and I stepped out of the AB room, I could see the others running towards the monitor, shoving and pushing to get closer. I didn't ask for praise, I answered your question. Well, you said, there you go. <laughs> God, I'm so lost. Yes. We're going through simple things. She hasn't betrayed once, what but was who that, was with Sigma? her? Don't what do you mean, dumb. who was with her? You chose ally. Didn't you <sighs> hear me? I told you that if your BP drops to zero, you die. <laughs> Connor, you've missed you've missed a little bit of of this game. Just just a little bit. But we think we're a robot. We think we're on Mars. No, the moon. And we think that Junpei is a time traveler now, and that he's an old man who adopted a kid and named him after like an atom well, part. Uh, its processing power increases during a crisis. It starts working so fast a that a second yeah. can seem like an eternity. Your brain was doing that right before. Don't explain anime to me. It? Well, am I wrong? Of course, I wasn't deciding. I was asking the chat. Let's be generous and say hypothetically that you're right about this crisis overclocking thing. How would you know whether or not my brain was doing that? Did you crack over my sc All right, Sigma, calm down. You missed a little bit. SpongeBob meme. I don't know how to reenact this SpongeBob meme, but you get what I'm trying to do. Let me be straight with you. Your shit is whack like hella whack. Shouldn't there be a H in there? Uh, I mean, you just know stuff you shouldn't. Stuff like my name or how your BP hits... If your BP hits zero, you die. Man, he's really flaming her here. <laughs> Wait a minute, you did the actual whack meme now that I think about it. Your smile? Whack! The way you laugh after telling a bad joke? Whack! Your pants? Whack! The treats your mother brings out whenever people are over at your house? Whack! Okay, you always say that. What are you kids doing over there? We're about to announce the results. Let's go. Time to see what the results are. Maybe it's different this time. So now, Connor, we find out whether Luna allied or betrayed with us. If she allied with us, we both gain two points. We're currently at three. If we get to nine, we get to escape. If she betrayed, she gains three points, and we lose two points. Me? I'm tight as fuck. Exactly. 
Black makes me w miss VB. Virtual boobs. <laughs> Looks like you're all here. Finally. Let's get ready to rock! And the decks game! Round one! The results! If everybody will please direct your eyes to this monitor. Oh, I get what's going on now. <laughs> Oh, Clover did betray Alice. Luna? That's the first time they happened. That's crazy, that Clover be betrayed. Be be uh, Clo uh, yeah. Now, let us check the numbers on our bracelets. Wow, a lot of sixes. Damn, uh, fucking oh, Quirk no, and Dio okay. betrayed Tamioji as well. I only did what anybody would have done. I believed in you and Fi. When Luna glanced away, I threw Fi what could only be described as a smug grin. Rather frustratingly, she didn't respond, only turned away, unperturbed. I was about to press the issue when I heard Ten Miyoji's voice. His own child. What happened? No, no, it wasn't me. <gasps> Mr. Dio tricked me. He told me he'd pick Ally. He, he, he promised. I believe That's it. That's why I let him do the voting. Is this true, Dio? Are you serious? This kid's full of shit. What? I didn't do squat. Quark oh, you did, Dio. decided how we were going to vote. And you want to know what he told me? You just leave the voting to me, Mr. Dio. Grandpa's going to choose to ally for sure, because I'm his opponent on this one. I think we should betray. To be honest, I'm getting kind of tired of the that. What the fuck are you saying, Sean? No, he definitely didn't say that. It's time for him to go. What do you say we leave the old fart here and leave? I've got a plan. See? Don't worry about me. <coughs> Don't worry about me. me. He'll believe whatever I tell him. Besides, if he still trusts me, that'll make it easier to use him again later. What do you say, Mr. Dio? I know this man grazed me from birth, but, um, I'm six now. I don't need him anymore. You're lying! I know how to poop all on my own, and it only took me six years. Sure, kid, keep whining. See if I care. Grandpa, you believe me, right? Don't let this brat fool you, old man. All of this is just part of his plan. It's gonna be kind of sad if Tamioji doesn't believe him. Did you really laugh at the word That's poot, enough. Shannon? Don't lose your temper. How long have I known you? I could be deaf and blind, and I'd still know if you were lying to me. Really? <laughs> You're just as gullible as he said you'd be. Hook, line, and sinker. Let me give you a little warning, Tenmyoji. <laughs> what if we did, Shannon? Shit is a hell of a poot. Hunter. Poot, and you try to pride yourself on the fact that you don't, don't laugh at Fiji, but, but you I laugh mean, at Poot. I trust the kid as far as I could throw him, and at your age, that can't be much. You hearing me, old man? Keep an eye on him. What? <laughs> I hope that was on purpose, because it's really funny if it was. It's all right, I understand. I'm so sorry. I apologize. This is very unfortunate. I can't, I can't point properly anymore. I'm a simple being. It looked as though another argument had taken place while Quark and Dio were fighting. Whatever it had been about, it appeared to have the result. It had appeared to have resolved itself. The past is the past. There's no point complaining about it. I'll just have to try and get those points back in the next AB game. 
which means Zero she's gonna betray. Round start. What makes you think we'll be having another round? Well, you said round one. If there's a round one, then there's luck. And then she's gonna the rabbit's gonna talk about who they think's gonna die next. I'm changed from red to cyan. Me too. Ah oh, shit. Cyan oh wait, that's a good thing actually. Alice is the most likely to be a bitch, but the fact that she's with us means we get to decide. Mine too. Wait. Can't tell if you like it or I not. I guess the colors weren't the only thing. Is it like hot chocolate? I don't understand how you make so many Sarah. types of tea. You're right. Mine switched from solo to pair. Mine is now a solo as well. Howdy, dudes. Looks like well, that's Judy. Too. I've gone from solo to pair. I'm still a pair. The three of us seem to be magenta now as well. I'm yellow, and it still says solo. Fi, you and Dio are yellow now too, right? Yeah. Looks like I'm a pair. It's just T. Well, that's a shame. When did they change? Um, also, uh, Shannon said. Oh, so when Clover betrays uh, Alice, it's fine, but when someone else does it to Alice, bitches and whines for the rest of the game. Yeah, and then kills him. And then is like, oopsie. I'm such a terrible person. Any major revelations? Uh, oh. Theory. Um, when we So we, we teamed up with Luna this time. We've gone down this route. And the old lady died again. We found the old lady dead. Which means that the only time the old lady didn't die is when we paired up with Alice. Which makes me think that Alice is maybe the one that killed her. And that's pretty much it. So why is the rabbit with Chinese clothes? I don't know why. It's it's the new it's an AI for the new bad guy. Um. Now. I don't know why it looks like all that. Of that explained. I must bid you adieu. I think this is it gone now anyway. We may never meet again. Yeah. What? Well, there's not really anything for me to facilitate anymore. I know in the third I mean, game. It's like a plague doctor, I think, is the is the bad guy. Is Zero. I'll never <laughs> Get fucked, Rabbit. We'll find more notes from the rabbit with shitty puns, but hopefully I'll be able to skip over that. Also, Connor, if you wanna keep catch up on the on these on these uh, streams uh, they're all up on YouTube on on youtube.com slash Mickey D's Vault of Streams. Uh, I think that works. Otherwise, just look up Mickey D's Vault of Streams. Um, I think all the all the uh, Zero Escape streams have been uploaded to it. So we're like 18 hours in exactly. Um, the beauty of the YouTube videos is you can skip through the first half an hour of. Uh, of talking and get straight to the game. It's great. Uh, wait a minute, I should actually read that. No, not that, not that. This. I spent a few minutes wallowing in misery. I figured I deserved at least a little self-pity, but even I knew that brooding and whining wasn't going to get me anywhere. Like Kay had said, we needed to at least try and find a way out. So I shook my head to clear it, stood up straight and headed off. Looge. Oh, nice, Hudy. Currently, I think it's got it's got Nancy Drew, uh, Killer Seven, this, which I think is up to like seventh parts, um, and Dead Space, which the last part of Dead Space oh, is going up tonight. Perfect timing. Pretty much straight after this. You were stream. here earlier, right? Did you find anything suspicious? Like, uh, secret pathway or something. Anything else, then? Anything out of the ordinary? That was a good plug for the YouTube. 
How about this? The date? No, that's not one again. Okay. This New Year's Eve then. Says it's going to happen or has happened. Wait, what did you say? You should go to Bachman that will just days? link it if anyone asks. What are you talking about? That's Hudi. Hudi is a bot. Wait a minute. On who Zero is grass? or my Sigma robot hand one still looking good. Sigma robot hand still looking good. No idea who Zero is. Um, what you did miss, I don't know if you missed, it just happened, was uh, Alice was with Clover, and Clover chose to betray Alice. Uh, that's an interesting fact, but outside of that, no major revelations. Yeah. I was abducted in the middle of the night on December I don't know if you missed the end of the last stream, but I don't really remember what happened. I, uh, we got the whole thing about Ten Miyoji. was the 20th. Me the bought, me do bought things. Exactly. Days. I don't want to have the bot do like timer things where every like 10 minutes it goes, Hey, follow my Instagram. Follow my Twitter. You Maybe know, they kept I us think on that's the annoying. Soap or it just IV drip or something. takes over In the theory, chat. You could have I don't care that much. At the same time. The YouTube's you the just for convenience point. sake. You saw it? Then I think that was like the last I think interesting that's thing. Likely. Yeah. We so got Alice a big spiel from Alice. Not on a timer, like you can just do exclamation point vault. Hey, you need to, you need to do that. You too? But we'll take I over the stream. It I will. Connor, you know about the sound effects, right? right? Subscribe Maybe to my OnlyFans. You so Only hands. Your muscles start to atrophy if you don't use them. Evolve into an AI. Pretty sophisticated. Actually, has Connor seen its, its new name? Fat clip. No idea. There's a sound effect. <laughs> this is just the section at the start where we get to know nah, all the characters and, the and then oh, files well, show up and be like cat. either fire or quark i can't remember it'll be like there's yeah. a ball something about a cat and, a and then quark and there's like a 50 50 chance quark will be like i'm gonna to kill myself <laughs> and we'll be like no put him to sleep There's the uh, there's the bot name. Uh, yeah, I didn't think so. Can either. you guess who named the bot? Cause it sure as hell wasn't me. Actually, there was one thing. What? I wasn't trying to hide it. The right moment to mention it just never came up. You don't need to apologize. Just do a couple jumping jacks, please. Well. See for yourself. Still twink related? What do you mean still? How Alice hasn't gotten sick since, has she? Yeah. Not in this timeline. She hasn't gotten family. sick. Let me see that. She did get sick in the Quark Tamioji timeline in this one. Because she she actually died, remember? We found her dead. And and then we continued. Radical six infection spreads. Cure continues to elude authorities. Just read the article. I swallowed and began to read. This is going to be about Radical Six, isn't it? Yeah. Let's skip it. Thought it was going to be changed a while back. No, it used to be. What did it used to be? It used to be Ben Akia, and then we changed it, like, probably a month ago. To the Twinkinator, and uh, there's a countdown, which if you want I can link that uh, to when it gets changed again. So what we do is when you it when it's up for being changed, Radical Six thing? whatever stream I'm doing on, is also a bit drive. So whoever yeah, gives the most bits gets sure. to name it for the next like but three months. Look at us. We seem. I think that's healthy. a fun idea. Admittedly, I don't know what the symptoms of Radical Six are, but if it's killing people worldwide. They must be horrific. 
Radical yeah, Six is the infection that's salt. getting everyone. You get infected by it, you want to kill yourself because time moves slower shapely. and it like disorientates the fuck out of you. Does this beauty look like something and Quark has it and Alice has it. They just haven't gone loopy you yet. Want to touch it, don't you, boy? I can the see fuck? it in your eyes. Weird. Go on. Try. At the speed I got is about 40 times the force that holds your joints together. Okay, so I would that fall apart. That could just apart. be from sleeping for a couple of days. Or maybe it's a side effect of that drug. Looks like this Besides, dude's got an infection of the radical, the bro. Don't you think there aren't boom, enough, boom, uh, people? Boom. This thing is killing people all over the boom. world, right? So why would there only be nine of us here? Think about it. Zero is forcing us to play this nonary game. Why would the government quarantine people and then make them play a game? It's a shame the stream went out last it night is. just as Hudy finished those calculations. I uh, I finished Donut Cunty, and uh, it was an exciting ending. We went up against the Trash King. Probably we fought not. his King Quadcopter. It got gory as well, which was kind of a fun twist at the end. And... Uh, then we built the giant elevator and catapulted everybody out of the hole. That's true. I hope they're all right. <laughs> Wait a minute. When did this virus actually show up? I've never heard of it before. Neither have I. Been sitting on that fact for 24 yeah. hours. I apologize. Did your internet go out last night? Because I know Kian's did, and I'm pretty sure Ben's did too. If these radical six killed hundreds of thousands of people while we were asleep, just how long have we been here for? Well, we know three people could have been in cryostasis. Able to just puzzle that out. How many known games the truth, are there? There's three. More this is the second one. Katie's our nonary expert. So she can she can clear or she can confirm. Uh, Alice and I are gonna stick around, you know, just in case you miss something. Don't really feel like I can trust Trinity you. Was fine. Oh, you lucky bastard. Quick the upgrade? Huh? Where to next? Are you saying quite the upgrade? The three D models. I dislike the 3D models, they have weird mouths. And Clover's is bugged, so she always is smiling. Quite the upgrade. It's good, dudes. Cut a case of the Hello, radical. Sigma? Nothing yet. Just call me Siggy. Well. Alice, Clover, and I did the 2D go over this room quite thoroughly. It looks nice when they're looking at their hands, and I'm like, oh, 2D. Well, yeah. Um, well, Alice is I dead? Was concerned about the lady you found. Dead lady. Who would do such a horrible thing? So Tamio you know, didn't have a wife, because Quark never you. mentioned it. Do you think that's oh, old please. Akane? Why would I kill this woman? It was like, he and my close companion wrong. has killed herself. I'm just saying the is Kaya Cyborg? Right we don't know. He has, he has amnesia. The future, that could change. He's either a cyborg or a man in a suit. Well, we don't know for certain that he's in a suit. But we, we just kind of assumed. But we also have a theory that one of our arms... We cut our arm Beats at one me. point and white goo I've came out of it. And it looked a lot like cum. But Sigma was pretty either. insistent it wasn't cum. So his hand bled well, white. I suppose I might have known it before I lost my memories, but uh, there's no way future to know. Akane, yeah. There. You still it's can't implied remember that he's anything? in a suit, yeah. No. See, he doesn't remember anything. Not even a little, unfortunately. He's like buff, uh... Senyata? Fuck, how did I forget his name? They're tell me the truth about this amnesia stuff. I'll pee down your neck and it'll get stuck in your suit. Might as well have a suspicious tattoo to crash your forehead. He might, we don't know. If someone ran into you on the street at night, they probably Zinyana. pass out from fright. Buff Corral. Maybe even during the Come day. As you see, he's a oh. Spartan. 
I'm so sorry. Did you see Buff Corel did a, uh... My frightening appearance. He did the Yakuza songs recently. <laughs> Perfect. I sent it to Sean as well. It's not really something you need to apologize for. Being a stupid bastard. Sorry I threatened to kill you. No. I and suppose pee not. down your suit. Well, I assume... Fuck off. No, he did. But... Soon I, sure I love you, Campana Potenza. I need to see that. You also need to check out his merch. His merch is fucking amazing. It almost feels natural. It's so funny. I was forced into it. Are you saying this is how you always look? No, I don't think that's it. This might be a pretty obvious question, but. Is I need the leggings. There's no explaining it. No. Shannon, if you can find them and link them in the chat avail. for people to see. I honestly don't even know where to start. It's just so funny. Oh, but there is something I'd like to ask of you. There and if you don't know Buff Corral, do yourself a favor. He's like yeah, my favorite. He's the perfect YouTuber. A switch or something similar? He's become a soldier as a child. He could be. I mean, we're dabbling into time travel at this one. With no further warning, he removed his robe and turned it back to us. Whoa, he's never done this before. It took no time at all to find something of interest. Whoa. There's a hole here on the back of your head. And an Xbox logo. An Xbox Power logo. Yeah, it looks like you insert something. What could we insert? He did 24 hours in a row. He did. It was, it was pretty perfect. It says open, open so maybe you can open take it up. Mask off. Have we seen see anything that? that could open up? That's excellent open news. That we just need to find whatever it is that goes in there, then. Thank you. I feel somewhat relieved. I was beginning to fear I might have to spend the rest of my life like this. Wait! A minute ago, you said that it felt natural. Well, it does. But that doesn't mean I want to stay in it forever. Imagine having glasses, for instance. Wearing them doesn't feel strange. But you'd hardly want to wear them all the time, forever, would you? That's what wearing a suit is like. Well, I think that's enough about me. Could we move to the next room now? No. There still might be something here. I'm staying. Me too. I see. So I'm going with one of my old I'll coffee books. And see how our companions are doing. I was really not expecting that. But like I said, there's no real describing it. Describing it would not have done it justice, but it's pretty Where great. I was thinking to make over the quick waters. You know, with the bombies. I shall head for the lounge then. <laughs> Until we meet again. Excuse me. You want out already? What's your problem? I fear I'm gonna find a torn up copy book when I eventually leave this room. Sam's in a mood. Like he's like. It's just for anyone that doesn't want to click the link. Most of his merch is like the generic, like, bot-made stuff where it's just a picture of him put onto the shirt. But he also has leggings. So it's like a picture of him put onto his leggings, but, like, his face Sigma. is on this side. Here? And this is just, like, it's a mess. Like, his face, it just doesn't work. Okay. And Wonder. is perfectly buff Corral. I wouldn't have it any other way. Oh, well, you think so? Are you sure it ain't just all in your head? No, that was definitely a dead lady. Why do you want to know? Well, he has one of those posters hung up in his room. <clears throat> I 
For anyone that doesn't know Buff Corel, he's a specimen. He's a man who sits in his room and sings songs that his viewers suggest. And, and he dances along to them. And he's perfect. Can I have a one? Is he? Oh my god. He's the perfect YouTuber. I have. Uh, Sigma, I, I you love come him. From? No, it's okay, I guess. See, I'm I gonna try to fucking tap no these ladies again. Other person here. This is the crew quarters. I came here with Clover and Ten Miyoji. Sits. We decided what? we'd split up to investigate. Zero. No, I meant I found zero things. Stupid bitch. I didn't find anything either. Also, that's Clover. Although, I guess Pink you could girl say this whole facility is the one who can't suspicious. not smile. And when she does open her mouth, it's horrifying. Those two plan to kill someone. We've gone through a lot of timelines, and Luna seemed really, really nice. So either she's a really convincing twist villain, or she is actually nice. Clover has also offered to fuck us at one point. But it didn't work out. Also, we should probably explain the fact that Clover is like a secret super agent, and so is Alice. Um, well, this is just, um, speculation, but maybe it's for entertainment, so rich, powerful people can watch. Yes, they're probably off in an opulent Well, like everyone's abandoned us at some point, except Luna. Oh, you think so, huh? So some rich bastards killed her off for kicks. What kind of a death is that? Well, maybe her dying didn't have anything to do with the rest of the game. Connor, do you yeah. remember Clover from the Age first right. game? If her dying wasn't well, I think he was, might also be talking about Alice. Something. But what did we get? Nothing. She wasn't a super agent in the first game. Disappears. But I want to know if you remember her from the first game. Yeah, Snake says. She was, was 20 in that game. Plans. She was 20 years old. You can think of another way all this fits? Well, I'd love to hear it. So you're saying that Zero Senior is the one who murdered the old lady? Hell, it sure looks that way. Fucking loved that Snake. K might be Snake. Anybody could be the murderer. Well, Alice and well, no, I she's able to communicate with him telepathically. But here, someone else has a more powerful metamorphic power or whatever the fuck it is that's scrambling her ability and it's probably us what come on or zero k Alice might be I know each other. k might be zero k might be how snake you, snake might be k uh, we did see zero so actually yeah no i remember we did see zero at one point and you guys were like snake but zero was wearing a monocle and had his other eye it's open kind of which is thing. not snake like what kind of Organization. Um, that's. And he had a robot hand. No, we got the robot hand. I don't think Zero had a robot hand, did he? He just had a glove on one hand. I mean, I can't tell you. Just forget about it, okay? Why can't you tell us? He went on about termites as well. It was weird. It's confidential. A for Snake. Well, Snake's real Clover name was Light, remember? I don't think he goes by Snake anymore. Snake was just because he was number two. The hand was definitely mechanical. No, Snake did have a robot hand. Or Zero did have a robot hand, too. Yeah. Termites. But what if the people you work for have something to do with what's going on here? Termites. Yeah. You're that right. didn't really work. My hair's not Maybe long enough I to mess up. You. It's not long enough to be hey, imperfect. Sorry to butt in, but it's time to go. Are we not finding the bomb in this timeline? No, we're not. We gotta go. <laughs> you think? Oh, I guess we'll just have to continue I'll this I'll kill you, later. old man. We need to get back to the doors. 
What if zero is future sigma? Sigma Wapra? <laughs> As a like cuties, yes, Shannon, there we go. As if he was sitting on that, waiting for someone to think about it. Like, finally, there we go. You figured it out, Shannon. I knew this since episode two. Jon Snow is dead all along. I think we're gonna get, so we're teamed up with Alice, so we're gonna go with Alice anyway. I think we're gonna get the choice between Clover and someone else. I don't know who the someone else is. Where are we trapped? The moon? We don't know. I'm pretty sure it's the Roman moon, Shannon. Possibly the moon or Mars or Five the Earth. Minutes remain until chromatic doors K close. is Jon Snow. You spelled Jon wrong. Ugh, you're late. Careful, what don't poke my eyes out with those things. <laughs> An apology is not going to cut it. She's a real bitch during this section. You. Zero said we'd get penalized if we didn't go through the primary door before it closed. Are you trying to kill me? <laughs> Here's an annoying fact about Alice that Connor will hate. Her and, her and Clover know each other, right? So if Alice has the choice with teaming up with Clover, she'll be like, we have to do this. Um, no point in using democracy we need, I need to team up with Clover because it's what I want. Whereas if she doesn't have the chance of teaming up with Clover, she'll go, let's put it to a vote and democracy. Clover, what do you want? And I'll vote alongside you. <laughs> You're super agent outfit. I mean, it's pretty distracting. Are you kidding me? Think it through, Sigma. If we spin yes, her at, what is it, a quarter the speed of light, she'll now fucking knock us all out. Game. She'll have three propellers. Awooga, awooga. Right she has also killed us in a timeline. It's only a democracy when she's understand? on top and everyone else is letting people on one no way people. to open either door, huh? Man, that sounds even worse than getting your lungs turned off. Two thirds the speed of light. Sorry, Sorry for worrying I couldn't work. remember. In India, oh, fuck the. Was hard you see Quark there? Like is Quark already trying to As kill you himself? Can see, the primary doors have already opened. We must hurry and decide who will be going through which. Yeah, she door killed us because she betrayed us. We died, and then we went back and allied with us, and she betrayed. Uh, no. No, then we betrayed her. I'll just explain it as fast as I can. All right, let me explain this. We had a timeline where we were up against Alice. We were on one point, and she was on five or six, right? She didn't want to lose points, and she was convinced we were going to betray, so she chose betray. And in the first time we did it, we chose ally, right? And that got us killed because we allied with her, we lost two points, we went to minus one, and we fucking died. Then, in the other timeline, we went back, we chose Betray, and she was like, Aha, I was right to choose Betray because you would have taken points with from me if I didn't. And we were like, Bitch, if we hadn't chosen Betray, you would have killed us. And she was like, Yeah, but you weren't going to choose Ally anyway, so I was right. <sighs> Just like before. There are only three possible combinations. Yeah, she was also unconscious. That's why we were confident in choosing ally. Because if you don't vote, if you're not in the room and vote, you automatically choose ally. She was unconscious in the med bay because she was recovering from the suicide radical sickness. And she woke up and ran there because she was convinced we were going to betray. So not only did she just choose to kill us, she woke up from a coma, sprinted in the last like five minutes, to kill us. Whatever. The options Phi laid out for us were the following. We can team up with Luna. Go through the green door or we can team up. Yeah, okay. Or we can team up with Kay. Oh, okay. Oh, Clover's the other cyan. Oops. Alice is a bitch. Just like the simulation. It's always just like the simulation. But Badonkers. I mean, yeah, she's still got my heart deep down. 
Option C, Alice and I and Clover would pair up and go through the red door. We, we don't have three choices here, right? Oops. Yeah, we only have two, so... It is pretty distracting. She doesn't have anything on. It's just a necklace that's covering her nips. Not practical. Hamana, hamana, ooga, ooga. I'm not going up again. Oh? Why not? We'd end up playing against each other in the next AP game. Bonk. Last time, that's my jaw falling off. off. How am I supposed to know you? I also probably object to one. Probably. Uh, you can't be trusted. Oh no, this is Tamioji doesn't want to go with K. To be honest, however, I would rather not go with you either. Yeah? Why's that? Well, you only have one BP left. I very much doubt you'll choose to ally in the next round. Even if you promised me you would choose to ally, well, he's I not going to betray this horrible situation. You see, I wouldn't be able to choose to betray. If I did, and you were true to your word and allied, then I would kill you. <laughs> so there you are. Farewell, Amber. That Thanks is why for tuning I do not in. wish to be paired with Tenmyoji. Of course, for the same reason, I would rather not be paired with Alice. Actually, Amber, if you have that link for Sigma Nancy Drew, you should send it on to Ben so he can get a free M and Nancy Drew. Year. Ben would be into yeah. that shit. I want to go with Alice too. Unless the light has already done it. Goodbye, Lee. Oh, don't say that. I'm being brought back to season one of The Walking Dead. Telltale's The Walking Dead. Last time. Ooh, I like the sound of that. I'm Fi's partner. You should pair up with us. Sound good? No. I am also opposed to that choice. If Alice and Clover pair up, then Luna and Dio pair up, the rest of us don't have a choice. We'll be stuck with Fi's Okay, so we can't go with Clover. I believe I mentioned before that I do not wish to be paired with Tenmyoji. And I don't want to go with Kay either. What are we supposed to do? Alright, after this decision, I'm gonna run and take a piss, because I need to piss One real bad. One minute remains until chromatic doors close. <sighs> the wolves. Oh shit, he's going crazy now. It's all over. This is it. This is the We're radical. We're gonna die. Are you all right? No. No. That's not it. Don't you get it? We aren't gonna die. We have to die. We have to die here. All of us. What the hell? I'll snap out of it, kid. Oh, come on, Quark. Talk to me. Preach. No, I'm fine. You're the crazy ones. All right, I need to piss. Take the one crazy one to kill himself. Enjoy. Game. I should just stop. End this. End all of it. End everything. We need to get him to the infirmary. No, we don't have time. Thirty seconds remain until chromatic doors close. We don't have a choice. Quark's with me. I'll carry him through. But we still haven't figured out who's going where. I can't afford to be picky anymore. Someone just choose. I don't care who. Sigma, you have to choose. Please, just do it. We don't have any time left. Nine, eight, seven.
Alright, I'm back. Can't go with Clover, because Sigma... Ah, oh, thank you. What did I miss? What happened? Thank you for the hydrate, Yudi. I'm gonna go with K. We haven't we haven't done anything with K. Right. We should hurry. Jump yeah. no. we, we took off toward the door at a run. I glanced back over my shoulder to see the others heading for their respective doors. The discipline not to redeem all five. Connor, if you don't know, you can use channel points to make me drink, but due to previous shenanigans, we'll say, um, it is limited to five drinks per stream per person. Two, can one, you hear the dog? Zero. Closing. They're being real douche nozzles tonight, bros. Dog is audible. Yeah, her tail just tap 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 tap. And that's because I told her to go up on the couch, and she was like, "No, look at me. I'm sitting on the floor." And I looked at her, and she was like, "Oh my god, she's fucking looking at me. I'm about to get sweets. I mean treats. I'm gonna get fed. I'm gonna get fed because he's looking at me, and then he's gonna give me belly rubs." And instead, I just opened the door, and she ran off into the hall search of treats and belly rubs. There was no discussion about it this time. <laughs> well, that was easy enough. Only open the door on the right, though. Then we are likely meant to go there. How do we get the other no doors idea. to open? There do not seem to be any other mechanisms which might cause them to unlock. He's holding treats in his fist. Something we should be worrying about. Treats and pets. We have a door that's open. We should go through it. You are correct. There is little to be achieved by remaining here. I think this is the first time we've done a room with K. You know, one K is really enough. Two Ks, kind of pushing it. Three Ks. The rec room, apparently. Oh, you didn't see it. There was a plate on Who's the that door. Guy? It said rec room, as I recall. Short for recreation, one might assume. I kill ironic. you. I doubt recreation is foremost on any of our minds right now. It's on mine. That's what I'm doing. I'm recreating. God. Da, 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 da. If you think the armor's weird, check that thing out. Is that oh, fuck a ride? Yeah. Oh, you're telling me. I see them in front of grocery stores all the time. You put a coin in, and it kind of rocks around. You must have gone on one at least once when you were a kid. I have no memory of doing so, but it is possible. No, I don't think so. I guess it's part of someone's collection. That seems like an exceedingly odd thing to collect. <laughs> this place has a lounge, some sleeping quarters, and now this rec room? It's like we're in some kind of luxury cruise liner. Oh god, look at the sign beside the darts. It does give me the impression that people are supposed to stay here for an extended period of time. <laughs> lads are small but well stocked and firmly. Look at those lads having Anyone fun. Would be able to treat at least but to smite each other. So you think this room is to help people keep from going out of their minds with boredom? Yes. Relaxation is important in an isolated environment. Cold. I'm putting on the blanket. I'm putting on the blanket. I'm wrapping myself in it. We're getting comfy. 
I agree. How did you get? Let's just find those moon oh, vibing. I thought you said Vikings. Oh, I was wondering how you got vibing. <laughs> hey, look, Connor. It's like we're in uh, Ryder Square again. Because I'm in the black. In, the in other words, the moon cards must be in this room somewhere. Bro's piping while I'm... while I'm piping? Yeah, I got it. Don't worry. Sick. Well, that's not the order you put them in. What? Oh, Dragon Ball. I know that. I'm piping. I'm piping? I was vibing while I am vibing. And bibbing? And bibbing? And bibbing? Vibing. And vibing. Alright, Alice. <laughs> Also, I'm present now. What lore did I miss? Moon, uh, more, more likely, uh, by the second. I can't remember why, but something happened, and we were like, Moon? Um, I don't know if you were there for it, Ben. I'll go through it again. This is the last time I'm going to explain it. Old Lady was also dead in this timeline, which leads me to believe that Alice is the one that killed her, because, uh... K is ace, yeah. Yeah, no, confirmed. Also, Fi's dead. Um, and Santa is Clover. It's crazy. Um, but yeah, because this is the only timeline, the only timeline where we didn't find the old lady dead is the one where we teamed up with Alice. I think Alice killed the old lady. Uh, there we go. What's this? So, your statue core is plugged in the right, but I'm not sure why. What do you mean? It's probably there so the right can get power. That's not what I meant. There's way too much slack. Does it look like the right's power cable is long enough without the extension cord? Then let's take the extension cable with us! Don't forget to plug the right back into the outlet. Yeah, yeah. We have it. What's this? A lot of screens. Oh. E. No, no, no. E. E. Sigma. <laughs> Anything we can hold Alice accountable for in court of law, I'm on board with. Uh, Clover and Alice went against each other in the AV game, and Clover betrayed her, and Alice was like, "That's ah, chill. I don't care." And now we're teamed up with Alice. <laughs> it's a scoreboard. Oh. Yeah. Extension! Come on, let me extension cord it. This is a jukebox. It plays an old form of music media known as a record. With the push of a few buttons, you can listen to your favorite song. Looks like it's not plugged in. I lit over there, but I don't think the cable's long enough. Won't reach, doesn't look like it. It's kind of easy to jukebox. Wait, Sigma! You got the solution! Why did we team up with Alice? We didn't get the choice. 
Yeah, that's our pair. We chose to go with K. Um, also, Quark didn't go loopy until we were about to go through the door. Uh, so he's suiciding in the puzzle room right now. Alice mixed up agent outfit with her prostitution outfit. Nah, that's not classy enough for a prostitution outfit. Nothing wrong with prostitution. There ain't. They're classy people. Let me hammer when I push the button. When you hit it, a little damage might make it more. What the hell kind of logic's that? Being locked means it work. What? Just saying it for anyone who wasn't aware why her F is so exposed. She gets cold. I mean, she gets hot. I take this often. She turn off the room lights. I believe the switch is near the exit. Maybe, maybe we shall. Maybe we shall. Wait, do these have any? No. Fucking couple of dinguses. He needs an axe as well as this guy? Oh, this guy's got a pool cue. I didn't even notice. Why does the shadow on the suit of the left have an axe? Hell if I know. Maybe it's a ghost. Perhaps we should concentrate on where the shadows came from. Rather, what the shadows mean. What they mean, huh? Nah, Ben, that's just a theory. And it's not a game theory. It's a theory theory. I push, I push circle button. I push circle button. Okay, I guess I can't push circle button. Okay, I need to turn the light back on. Um, this guy's got a pool cue. Give me that. Okay. And then can I set this up or do I need the triangle? What? A, B, C, D, E, F. What? Specific balls must go into specific pockets. For instance, ball A would need to go into pocket A and so forth. Press the A button to grab the ball, then drag the ball to the desired pocket and release it to drop it. Selecting the yellow triangle will allow you to switch which ball group is displayed. Pool time! Not the fun kind of pool. One, do you think it's one, fourteen, nine, six, eight, two? Let's try that. One, fourteen, nine, six, eight, two. Nine, six, eight, two. Oh, because this one's E. 
Right? Because E. Okay, I understand that. What? what? Can we write this thing? Can we do anything with this? It's your coin. Ooh, this is the same. Oh, Ben, one thing we did find out is that uh, K has a lock on the back of his head. Uh, like a like a slot, a key slot to open up the, the suit. And it looks kind of like that. What's the point of the pool cue? in the felt. Yeah. And that'll probably give us the other letters. So we can unlock him. Yeah. And then this will show us at night time. Oh, oh, oh. A, B, C, D, E, F. Okay, I probably won't remember that. I've already pretty much forgotten it. I think it was A, B, C, D, no. What was it? A, B, C, D, E, F. This one fourteen nine. So is it one fourteen nine? Over the others, six eight two. Six eight two. figure that out yet. This steer must have faced halfway through the wall and gotten stuck. How horrific! How many colors of balls are there? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I think. Blue, red, brown, purple, gray, green, yellow, seven. These all do have letters, so maybe everything outside of eight. But that still wouldn't have an order. Maybe we discount the eight ball. Yeah. Oops, what have I done? C's first one. Oh wait, it's probably probably all the. Uh, okay, I think I, I think I know now. Hmm, maybe I don't. Maybe we just continue. D. So if I do ten, this one's 
This one's deep. Oops. E. These ones lit up. Why? F is also yellow, though. Probably spots and the others probably stripes. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, but there's two yellows. There's no red. Um, so let's do all the spots. So let's do one, four. They have spots and stripes on them. What do you mean they have spots and stripes on them? Oh, they do. So... Four... Alright, there we go. Four, one... Orange stripe, thirteen... Should be right. There we go. C and F have stripes. I thought it was going to be all all the same. Um, that was a good catch. Is this someone came out of the ball retrieval slot? See down here. What's this? Dart tips. Oh, the dart. To the bottom of the dart somewhere. Oh, I didn't see this. What the fuck's this? Oh, there's the bottom of the darts. Give me that. somewhere. Nah, no way. Who needs clues? Nancy would say, it's locked. She doesn't always say that though. I've heard her in Nancy Drew games just go like, mmm, locked. And I was like, that's not the meme. So I don't think you can say as Nancy would say, I think it's just as Nancy said that one time, maybe if I'm remembering right. Uh, they also appear to be records for the jukebox. Now those look empty. We only brute force here. These look like they're empty. Let's see. Oh, I guess we need to get the records out. But Nancy Drew game, so you'd know better. Yeah, that's right. Fucking. It's locked. Yeah, well, fuck you. <laughs> Permission to use the sign. Oh, I should have seen that coming. How do we get an axe? Can we take this off him yet? No, I don't want any... Oh, wait a minute. There's de that's definitely a record in there. So he needs the axe so it smashes against this, but I can't take the axe. Yeah, that's what I wanted. And then take that off him. Take that off, take that off him. There we go. Give him the axe. I don't think he needs the lance, but you know, let's just, let's just not fuck him over. Give him something to fight back with. 
You son of a bitch, push that play button. <laughs> now I delete. Hey, you figured out how to delete messages. Nice. Allen wrench. <gasps> Wait, that wasn't a record? It was just the Allen wrench? Well, the Allen wrench doesn't fit into that. Fit into the mud? One of the lower corners has a circular hole. Oh, there we go. I figured it out, Ben. I figured it out, I figured it out on the night of the Nancy siege. Well done. We can probably also use this key to open up K. Oh, so many, so many coins! Oh, we're rich! There is no God. <laughs> Was Katie just sitting there being like, please, please put the coin in the rabbit machine? That's hilarious. Kay, live your best life. Go, girl. Look how happy he is. He's going to be a serial killer. Seems to have taken a picture. Hooray! K is quirk, it seems. That was delightful. Now, where is that photograph? There we are. Ex excellent. Give this to you as a memento of our time together, Sigma. Just holding it makes me feel wrong. No, no, that's hardly necessary. D1! Z9? That could be Z9 or 6Z. Uh, that's enough stream for one night. No, 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 please. Oh, this mute button doesn't work as well. Well, you guys just have to endure that, it seems. Um, it's like the dogs have an opinion on that. They really don't. Uh, can I, I can put coin in this. Shot. Also, wait a minute. What did Katie say? I'm waiting for a thing that comes later. Oh, Lord. I guess it's on now. So, D1? Yoink. And Z6. Do you think 9Z will work as well? Black. Nothing to see here. Move along. I there's a secret code for this one. There is. Um, you guys actually missed the first puzzle we did tonight. I got like the secret like five minutes into the puzzle and then spent another 20 minutes trying to figure out the actual puzzle. <laughs> it was, it was a real time. This one's going a lot more smoothly. We got the darts now. Give me the darts.
9Z was the correct one. Yeah, I know. So this doesn't actually tell... Oh. Yeah, yeah, I know how darts works. Well, usually bullseye isn't 100, it's 50, isn't it? Get a score of 91 with three darts. Keep in mind, however, the score for each area must have a specific relationship to the other scores. What? She said you like math. Oh, God. Uh, to throw a dart at a particular area, grab it and press A. Japanese in the goddamn soft tip. Soft tip darts? Why is it 91? Also, is it color based or just ring based? I don't understand what it means by relationship to each other. Does it mean that if it, if one's blue, they all have to be blue? Is it one of each color or do they all have to be the same color? I'm kind of confused. Let's just try going with 80. 60, I mean. Um, 15 times 3 is 29. So that gives it 8 is 89. And then we just need 2. No, we can't get 2. I thought that was a 1. That's why I was going for that. Um, we can go 80. 33, 83, and then a 6. Okay, here. 93. Oops. Okay, let's just see if it'll let us do different colors. It will. Okay, then I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if it's if they have to be the same color or different colors. I feel like 60 is a good start. What's, what's 17? 51. And then we need 40. Oh, but we need all three of them. So, what if we do 13 plus 17? 81. Idiot. Sixty. So we need thirty-one now. So sixty plus eighteen plus twelve. We don't have a twelve. We could do this. Twenty-seven. Oh, that's a nine, not a six. Oh, wait a minute. No, I want to do this. So what's the relationship? Do they all have to be the same color or different colors? Sixty plus fourteen, seventy-four plus seventeen. Is ninety-one, isn't it? Okay, it's one of each color. At the dark case. Me, look, nah. It's one of each color. Which makes it so much more confusing. It's gonna give you the order. Can't look? Oh, we can look. Red, blue, green. Twenty-one plus sixty, eighty-one. It only needs ten. That doesn't work. As I said, we brute force here. Um, has to be red, blue, then green. Thirty-four.
Oh, you're doing different math. Deal with it, pussy. Red, blue, green. Uh, 34 plus 14. Uh, oh, no, wait, that doesn't work. We need 53. That ain't gonna happen. Well, actually, could it have? What's 17 three times? Let's just check the easy way. 51. Damn. Twenty-two plus sixty. Oh. That doesn't work. Damn, so close. Nine. Wait, is the fact that it's smaller? Wait a minute. Like, maybe, because it gets bigger, doesn't it? Just, uh, yeah. As you can see, it gets bigger. Does that mean <clears throat> it's going from the inside out? So it's either 18 or 21, which we'll just go 21, because we need it to be big numbers. So then it's probably... No, this doesn't work out. Oops, I didn't mean that. Yeah, this doesn't work out. Could it be... Red. Blue. Oh, I should have done that. I don't think the size matters. Plus 60. Wait, this is my last chance to get it. Damn it. Eighteen. Seventy-eight. Oh, God damn it, Ben. <laughs> I got so excited. Also, I only just noticed that they go inwards. The order of the colors eluded me until now. It's like out, middle, in, out, middle, in. I didn't realize it was a spiral. that makes 18. Oh, damn. Green's just not in the right place because this would also make 18. That would make 18. That would make 18. Damn it. I just want to make sure my math is... It's what I thought it was. I don't know which one you're talking about. Uh, 
22. Oh god, that's 22, that's 21. That means... Wait, I'm not allowed to pick the middle. That wouldn't make sense anyway. Can I pick the middle? Twenty-two plus eighty. I need nine. What do I keep doing that? I almost did it again. Stop it, idiot. Okay, well it I don't know wait. Plus thirty. None of this makes 30, does it? <laughs> we did it, boys. We did it. What do I need? I need two twenty two. I make twenty two. No, I cannot. Damn, damn, damn. 34. So we need fifty seven. So we go sixty is too much. One eighteen sixteen fifty two. So now we need thirty nine. Which again we can't get. Thirty-one. We can't make. Oh, it's forty-one. No, it's fifty-one. Same thing as times three. Fifty-one. Back dog took a time. Shannon's your favorite thing in the world. Math. We have to make ninety-one, and we have to go in the order of red, then blue, then green. Still in the rec room? Yeah, we got kind of stuck on this puzzle because it's a lot of math. And I refuse to do it in an orderly fashion. That's that's Ben's method. This is my method. It'll just be just guessing, uh, as Hudi puts it, brute forcing it. Twenty-two. So we need we need sixty-nine. How did I make that before? It is nine and sixty. Uh, equals 40 so now we need 51 there we go what 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 so wait is it is it smallest to biggest a small red a medium blue and a big green 
21, 21 and 30, what is it, 27, what number do you have to make, 91, the number I just made. Oh, that's 6, I keep thinking that's 9, I keep getting these two mixed up. So a medium blue, this can't make it though. Big green. Right? Red, blue, green. I did go in the right order, didn't I? What was it? see any more of the clue. I think so. Oh, also, you missed this, Shannon. It's the biggest one. Yeah. But, like... We go thirteen. That's the only right answer. So that's wrong. Do we need twenty nine? So we need sixty two. 62, 51, we can't make it, so, too small. Uh, again, it's too small. Yeah, <laughs> So we can't we can't make ninety one by going biggest to smallest. Not in the archives, right? Yeah, it's the billiards poster. Not seen a darts player who I'd go, hey, he flirts with women. Well, the darts player I've seen uh, make me go, yeah, he needs a caretaker. What the hell happened to you? What? Wait, why did I take it? I can't flip it over. Keep in mind, however, the score in each area must have a specific relationship to the other scores. Toss a dart. Yeah, yeah. Does the size of the colors matter? I mean, I would have thought. Because, no, red's the smallest one. You cubic bitch. I mean, the score and not the size. Okay. Eh?
the dogs have finally decided to join us. Ah, I have a blister right on the tip of my thumb. It really fucking sucks, but it's not big enough to pop. Can't make 91 that way, yeah. Red's the smallest, we still can't do it, right? So red has to be like here. Blue, 54. Do we need 37? Can't make 37. Red is the biggest, you get the biggest score for red, which is this, I think. Blue, you get the second biggest. Blue is middle. What do you mean? Yeah, but even if red is either of these and blue is this, you can't make 91 if you get what I mean. Um, so that's the biggest we can make with red. Then, like middling, we can make four, no, we can make 20, we can make 17, 18, 6, 16. So it would be this, because um, that's 39 we can make. And then green, green's the smallest, it doesn't work out. Use the 11 blue. Oh right, 33, wait a minute, I didn't see the 33. Um, and seven. Did I do something wrong there? Red. Blue. I think I accidentally chose the third one. Sure. Um, what do we need? 20... 24? Can we make 24? That's the secret answer! We got the secret answer! Ah, for fuck's sake! That's the secret answer! Got the goddamn secret answer! Star, star, star. Whoops. Just reverse it for the other one. What are you doing, though? Shut up. I'll kill you. I will. Don't a runner. Right, whatever, I care not for the secrets. Um, oh, actually, I remember what I was doing with the secrets. If you want to read the secrets, pause now. If you want to read the previous ones, go back and pause. Pause. Uh, pause. Pa you know what to do. I'm not even saying it this time. When's Kate? Kate's gonna collapse. These are new ones. Uh. Okay, so we reverse it now. So what was it? Last one I did with it was this. But she's saying big, green big, then blue, then red. What's mid green? Was it not 24? It was this. What was the other one? It was this. And it was 
this. Did you see that? My earphone fell out. Screen hasn't changed. So the order doesn't matter. Because we just did it in reverse order and it still gave us the same solution. What the fuck? What the fuck's going on here, guys? I think I might get it. Oh. Uh, go green 20. Blue 11. 6 red. Okay, I get, I get what you mean. I don't get how I was supposed to get that. Was that what Ben had? Those are greater than symbols. Grammaths. Sun, sun, moon. But if you inspect it, he opens it. So don't really line up. I guess. I guess I see what you mean. Um. What was it? Sun, sun, moon. Short, short, short. Short, 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 short. So red is the smallest score. Blue is the middle score. And green is the biggest. I've done so much algebra for nothing. Went by the picture size instead of the symbols. It's the only explanation I can think of, Michael. Pretty duty. Um, that's twice now where we've solved the the secret one before by accident. Before we've solved the actual one. We get a key. They were the greater. Yeah, I assume they were arrows too. Well, actually, when he opened it, because I inspected it to. Uh, to get some clues, and the fact that he opened it, I thought it was just the arrows were pointless. Do you think K will collapse because we can kill him? No, K's on six, I think. Yeah, because K and Clover betrayed. I think we should ally with K because. Either he allies with us and we both prosper, or he betrays us and Alice dies. Alright, you two play nice. Cutie's here now. So, I'm sure one of the sides will win now. I like this plan. Also dog. Oh, you can almost get both dogs in frame. Oops. Interesting. No, 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 idiot. Idiot. Oops. Trying to estimate lines wasn't the way around it, that's all I know. Two dogs, wow, we are spoiled. Hey, look over there. Oh, both dogs have gotten off of the couch. Shall we have a look then? Ah, my thumb blister. Thank you. They're all the same though. This one won't open either. Yeah, you get pets too. Sam, I put the crisp spike specifically in that corner so like you wouldn't be able to hit it with your tail. 
Have we gotten any more keys for the story locks yet? Doesn't look like it. Nothing really big story-wise has occurred. Like we haven't had any revelations, so. Right. I'm picking Sigma. This is a democracy. What do you mean we vote? No, that means I get to pick what I want. No. Oh no. Well, I just feel as if I've seen this world. Well, we get a choice here. One of the men's quickly. I assume if we ally, he's gonna betray us and she's gonna die. Watch out, Sam. No. Perhaps I haven't been here. Get up there. Somewhere very similar. You mean the floor of the warehouse? Perhaps. An ambidex gate has been opened. Forty-five minutes remain until ambidex game. Fucking Dio. Someone else must have opened one of the AB gates. Sorry, right, dogs, you're making too much. Fun. I imagine they don't care what happens to the rest of us. That would be the most logical explanation. Do it was so quiet. In Do it is a quiet one. Should return quickly. Let's get going, guys. Win. I wish we could skip over this part, like Jesus. Oh, you know what it is? If we ally, Kay will betray us, kill Alice, and then he'll get nine, so he'll escape. Because he's on six right now. That's what's gonna happen. gonna double betray Alice to death and to freedom. Don't care, Kay can leave. Sigma? <sighs> Sigma what, bro? Nope. We were the first. Also, is Quark wait dead? A little longer before you open the AB gate. It Why was Dio! I, I tried to stop him, but... Oh, come on, it's not like when we open the door really affects the matches, right? It's cool. No, it's not cool. Your team returned quite early, Dio. Did your investigation go smoothly? I guess. The treatment center. She'll try the rock, paper, scissors shit. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, there were these pod things. Look, oh, just yeah, go see for yourself, all right? No, I don't I have don't fucking like time. Are right, you bitch? You took something from the treatment center, didn't you? Uh-huh. What are you talking about? The cure. You did. I saw it, too. After we opened the safe, you grabbed something out of it and put it in your pocket. Oh, Connor's still here, it seems. Show us what you took. Uh, get away from me. Clover shoved her hand in Dio's pocket and began to dig around. You got a big fucking meat sausage in here. It should be in this one. Let go. I'm squeezing it really hard and it doesn't pop. Before Dio could push her away, Clover found what she was looking for. I sure. knew it. An injection gun. The label on the vial says Neo Stigman. Stigman? Stay stay. Whatever. What's this I stuff for? Fat click. Amber's back from her quiz. Clover, master of seduction. I found it, so it's mine. That's how you pickpocket a guy. You start hey. jerking him off, and then you go th with your other hand, you go through his pockets, and then occasionally tickle his taint, and then you continue to go through his pockets. With a desperate lunge, Dio managed to grab the gun back from Clover before she had a chance to protest. He's gonna smash it, isn't he? He ran off, pussy. No, he didn't run off. Any Stick your twist it. No, Ben, that's too Any far. Please! 
asked if the counteracts the sedative. No, I think jerking a man off the door, is the sedative. After we left, he just disappeared. No, Ben, no dick twist. He's everywhere, but we can't find him. He's lost. Don't you think you're being a little optimistic there? Come on, well, Jerk's probably dead by now. All right, We've already fucking found one idea. corpse, right? What the hell is wrong with you? How could you? Why would you say such a horrible thing? Whoa, simmer down there. Just saying it's a possibility. Yes! As we began to file out, I saw Alice staring intently into the corner of the warehouse. What you looking at? It seemed strange, but looking for Quirk was my priority. Oh, is she gone loopy? I turned and headed toward the ma magenta door. I thought that word was going to be management. Gonna off himself for real this time. Kid, kid corpse? This is Spike Chinsoft, or whoever you fucking say their names, so they're not privy to child death. And Jesus, does Danganronpa 3 have some gory fucking deaths? Quick, are you in here? You lounging about, boy? Damn, let's try floor B then. Delicious water. All right. You just want me to stop playing this game, it's okay. You just tell me. I'll put on something else. You gotta torture me so. You know, I'm too, this new, this new desk position. I'm not slouched over like this anymore. I actually get to sit back, I got my feet up. You can't even see, but I got my feet up. So I don't need as much back cracking. I see. Stretch. I went to the treatment center, as well as the Floor B warehouse, but he was not there. I saw that coming. Good idea. Perhaps the others have had more luck. Oh, that didn't work. <coughs> well, did you find him? We've got one more for the whole night. I, I Actually, see. this... Also goes into tomorrow. To have returned. Yeah, we're it. Yeah, no clues or anything. I don't think <sighs> with this many people looking, it seems like we'd be able to find him pretty fast. There it is. Quark is only a child. It's possible he's become trapped in a small enclosed God, space. God, Kay is so fucking smart. Dropping real fucking facts on us all the time here. Yeah, you're right. Quark. Tamioji's shoulders slumped. He looked old, much older than he had when we'd met. Bitch. I could see her tear I could see tears glistening at the corner of his eyes. For just a moment, I saw in them all of his pain, fear, and despair. 
and it felt like someone had put my heart in a vice. Is that how you spell vice? Then Dio appeared, and the mood suddenly changed. That's not Dio, that's an empty doorway. Hey, you guys, come here! What are you standing around for? They're in the crew quarters! Americans. Just come on! Thank you. Yeah, I agree, it is Vice. It's Vice. Oh, weird. Is this just another damn it? Are we gonna see dead child? What, Luna too? Uh, no. Your heart stops. Your bracelet comes off. Luna's foot. There was a roaring in my ears, breathing, heartbeat, but my footsteps sounded muffled, as if I was hearing them through layers of cotton. Alright, Alice killed herself. Do you think Dio showed up and murdered Luna? I pressed a shaking hand to Alice's neck. Her skin was still warm, but the only pulse I felt was my own. <laughs> Do you think Dio's gonna be up against Luna now, so he killed her in order to help himself? Looking down, it was clear why. Something had been driven into her chest so far that only the hilt was visible, and the entire front of my body was covered in blood. <laughs> so much for Kay leaving. I mean, we still get a choice here. Uh, no one could survive something like that. Well, let's not, let's not say that. Forced myself to swallow the stinging lump in my throat and t turned toward Luna. The hilt of a... Isn't it a scalpel? A scalpel's got a hilt. I forced myself to swallow this... Uh, no, I already read that. Unlike Alice, at first glance, she, she, she seemed unharmed. As I reached for her neck to check for a pulse, however, I saw a red mark near her jawline. Nearby on the floor sat an injection gun. I already knew what I would find, but prepared my fingers to her neck and waited. Nothing. My They're dead. God. What on earth happened here? That bastard killed them. All right, Dio. Whoever it was that killed the old lady in the A B room. Oh, I thought he was gonna accuse Cork. You're saying this mystery person killed Luna and Alice? Maybe only one of them was supposed to be killed, but the murderer had to kill the other to keep them quiet. Or perhaps they killed one another. Luna yeah. stabbed Alice in the chest. After which. Alice attacked her with the injection gun. No, you That's stupid bitch. That's pretty far-fetched. Yeah, you stupid bitch robot. Look. Look at Alice's clothes. No sign of a struggle. What I clothes? I think they fought. Then were they killed somewhere else and then brought here? No. If that were the case, there would be much less blood. I guess that's true. Whatever the case, we have too few clues to figure it out right now. We'd all separated to look for Quark. Any one of us could have done it. You mean the killer is one of Do you think there's someone else in here? Do you think that Zero Senior killed these two as well as the old woman? Hmm. Oh, give me a break. You I killed just sit Luna. Here talking. There's no point in making a fuss. Are you fucking kidding me? One of us is a Are you killer. Are kidding me? I can't think of a better reason to make a fuss. You do realize you're the most likely suspect, don't you? Excuse me? You wait until the rest of us have gathered in the warehouse. Then you kill Alice and Luna. No, no, I just Luna. to be the first to find them and... Are you saying I did this? It's a self-report. I'm just saying it's a possibility. You don't need to get so worked up about it. Ten minutes remain. Until Ambidex Game Polling closes. All players, please. You think Alice killed votes. Luna? I don't think so. If no vote is recorded before the deadline has passed, I think Dio killed Luna. Voting parties 
Well, okay, we're gonna see what the matchup for this AB room shit is. Also, where's Clover? Uh, if you don't vote, your choice is set to ally. I guess that means Luna's vote will be ally for this rank. See, I think Dio is gonna go up against Luna here. Yes, it does. Perhaps that Luna might have tried to sedate her, and then she fought back and injected her? I don't think so. I mean, maybe. We have to betray Kay. Uh, no, I want to ally with her. and myself. Where's Clover? One person is missing, and the others bought the farm. I'd say this old fart's the most suspicious one here. You want to say that to my face? It's a cry to hold them down. You killed her so you could get a few more points in the AB game. Are you an idiot? How do you explain Alice? She's playing against Kay, not me. Uh, not quite. Even without his partner, Alice. Sigma will still be able to cast a vote as he wishes. Then maybe that's why Luna died. Maybe they meant to kill Sigma, but something went wrong and they... True. I suppose that is a possibility. But we are engaging in pure speculation here. I don't think there that's true. There's no evidence to support any of this. We should take their bracelets with us, then. Without their bracelets, some of us would be unable to open the secondary chromatic doors. You're pretty calm, pal. Too calm. You did it, didn't you? A sterling deduction. I await your further insight. He wears a mask, therefore he is guilty, perhaps? <laughs> what did you just say? It's pretty full, all this logic. Deep down, we all wear masks. <laughs> Agreed. We aren't getting any younger here. I apologize. We should return to the warehouse. Oh, Clover is here. Why did last time no! Clover freaked out over a killer? I'm not going anywhere. I can't just leave her here. If you don't vote, Dio might get out. Huh? He's got six BP right now. If you don't vote, you will automatically ally. And I bet my left arm he'll Okay, so I thought Dio was gonna go up That'd against be three Luna. Points, which will so put him at nine. my theory's kind of Once he's got false. That, Maybe they did kill each other. Him from opening the number nine door. I'll try and pick ally, of course. But Dio's not an idiot. And by kill I'll each other, I mean Alice killed Luna and somehow. then herself. Dio will have nine points? What are you gonna do, Clover? If you what? stay here, you might be letting Alice's killer get away. Fine. I'll do it. There's no way I'm going to let him get nine points. Good. Let's go. Five minutes remain. Until Ambidex game polling closes. I took a deep breath and unlocked the AB room. No matter how hard I looked for an an for answers, all I found were more questions. Who had killed Alice and Luna? Where was Quark? Does Bruno Mars is gay? I wasn't in any kind of mood to play along with Zero's ridiculous games, but at this point, I didn't really have a choice. I, I heaved a silent sigh and started toward the entrance of my AB room. Sigma, what would Sigma you say Lumpra? to voting ally? I would reciprocate, of course. Of course, yeah. You have 5 BP. Mm -hmm. If we both ally, then you will gain two points, leaving yeah. you with seven in total. Mm -hmm. Should you also cooperate mutually in the following round, you would gain another two points. And hook and card door. Nice Conversely, game rounds, thank you. If you were to choose to betray me during this round, you would gain three points, for a total of eight. In other words, you will be unable to reach nine BP until the round following this one. Yeah, that but you will. Case, choosing ally is the most logical choice. 
Do you know what bro counter is at plus 10,000 at this point? I can't help it. As I recall, you and Clover chose Betray in the first AB game. That means you should have 6 BP right now. If you betray me and get another 3, you'll have 9. You could get all the way to 9 this round. Ah, yes, that is true. Yeah, he's However, like, oh, you... Escaping Ooh. as soon as possible is not my goal. Wow. But you picked Betray in the first round, didn't you? That was in the interest of my own safety. As I only he had three to points it. at the time, the prospect of losing two of them was very unsettling. Now that I have six BP, I have some room for error. Why wouldn't you want to get out of here as soon as we possibly could? Hmm? Hmm? Of course I would like to, but attempting to do so would be unwise. Is King missing his other hand? Isn't it obvious? If I escape on my own, everyone else will be trapped here forever. Have you forgotten what Zero told us? The number nine door only opens once! Once that opens, it's all over! It'll close for good after nine seconds, so if you're not careful, you can get stuck. <laughs> I trust you remember now? I found like six 91 combinations, alright? I'll have you know. Did you not realize? Hmm. Perhaps I shouldn't have said anything. Does he have another arm? Kinda looks like he does. Hey, don't tell me you're planning to just leave us all. That. Consider the following. If I did manage to get to nine points before anyone else, do you think the rest of our companions would allow me to leave? Especially knowing that, if they did, they would remain here for the rest of their lives? You see? Working toward leaving as a group is the most... Nah, I don't think he does. I think, I think he's only got one hand. One minute remains. Yeah, he's giving all this reason, and then he's gonna be betray and be like, LOL, pranked, pranked, no cameras because you're about to die, bye. I didn't. I didn't say I would suck your dick with my mouth. Now did I? I said I'd fuck you, and I'm fucking you over, bitch. Oh, my controller turned off. We're still gonna choose to ally, though. 30 seconds remain until Ambidex game. There's just been multiple scenarios where a character's like, I promise I won't screw you over. And then they're like, well, technically I promised I, I wouldn't let Quark screw you over. But I did it. So if I choose Ally and he chooses Betray, he'd have nine points. And I'd have two. Still, even if he did have nine points, he might not try to escape right away. I want to see what he does. I want to see if he's a fucker. Yeah, I agree. The question was, how much could I trust him? How much trust could I give a man whose face I'd never seen? Ten seconds remain until Ambidex game I think that's a question to ask the Christians. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one. At least you're not stuck in the AB room with Alice. Damn, the things we could have done. Round two of the results will be displayed in the warehouse. Results will be dispersed throughout the air. You could have explained Schrodinger's cat to us. Opening. Yeah. Hey, in fairness, it's been like two weeks since we've heard anything about Schrodinger's cat, so. Results from round two of the Ambidex game will now be displayed. Please direct your attention 
to the results screen. Ooh. Ooh. Son of a bitch. What a fucking son of a bitch. Points have been assigned or subtracted accordingly. Please check your bracelet to see your updated bracelet points. So you do <laughs> indeed choose ally. Yeah, I'm not a cunt. I apologize. Sigma! Sigma what, bro? Idiot. All right. He's got nine points thanks to your stupid ass. Nah, do the math again, stupid. I apologize Wait a minute. for taking further advantage of your trust, but I will be leaving. <laughs> what a fucking cunt. <laughs> Before we could react, Case slipped past us with speed and agility that belied his size. In the blink of an eye, he was standing in front of the number nine door. Damn it! Wait, you son of a bitch! <laughs> he didn't give any sign that he'd heard Dio. Just grabbed the lever and pulled it down. Crank. Got a fucking stupid smile. <laughs> the number nine door has been opened. It will remain. It was very much a situation of Dio being like, Sigma, you stupid bastard, now he's gonna escape. And Sigma's like, nah, K's not gonna leave, he's my best friend. The answer is obvious. Two. K? Excuse me, three. People have already been murdered. Okay. If I remain, I place myself in greater danger. A simple decision, really. I'm sure simple physics. Done... I know, we're trapped forever. I do intend to contact the police as soon as I have escaped. Now then. Yep, big man in a robot suit. Definitely. Definitely trustworthy. He didn't even turn around. What about Quark? Doesn't Quark have nine? Yeah, Quirk should also have nine. Fucking dickhead just left the kid too. Wait, was Quirk in the thing? Oh yeah, Quirk's missing. I goofed. Yeah, you're right. You guys are right. You're smart. You guys are smart. Thank you for your participation. Very clever. As the, as, the, as the Asians would say. All doors other than the number nine door. Have been unlocked. Escape is I didn't not like that show. possible. Please enjoy oh, your escape. Shannon, this is a PG game. <sighs> He's gone. Damn it! This is Damn all your it. fault, Sigma. Sigma Opera. There's no point to blaming him now. Yeah. It's not like we can open that door again. Ah, damn it! Damn it. Could you betray my trust? We stood there in silence, staring at the door. The only exit to the outside world, and that closed forever. Nah, Kay will be like, I understood why you chose that decision. Truly, it's the most logical one. Hopefully, in another time, you will have much more faith in me. Uh... Alice Luna, the old woman who had, who had killed them. And where had Quark gone? There were questions we still hadn't answered, but we had plenty of time now. Perhaps we still would.
Game L over. Twenty one hours in at this point. God damn. So many different endings. All right. Sorry, beach. Can't quite tell that I'm flipping them off from this angle. Results from round two of the Ambidex game will now be displayed. Please Friendship with K over to the results screen. Never using the letter K again. Oh, uh, uh. Oh. Get fucked, loser. So you picked Betray. Leading to a draw, it would seem. Because I knew you were going to pick Betray. I could ask the same of you. Guess that's fair. No, Sigma! I have thought that you would choose Ally. If I had, then you'd have 9 BP right now, wouldn't you? Yes, but I would not leave. Nice try, but I'm not gonna let you get out of here that easily, punk, bitch, tin can, As motherfucker. I told you before, even if I were to reach 9 BP, I would not necessarily leave immediately. I might choose to wait until everyone else had also reached 9 BP. Yeah. Uh huh. Then you do not trust me. No need to apologize. Trust so must loose. be earned in a game nice like this. There, Shana. This is the guy who told me to trust him so he could betray me. <laughs> Indeed. Clearly, I don't deserve to be trusted. Honesty is refreshing, but that's really not the brightest move. <laughs> Who don't we hate? So you chose Betray too, huh? You just picked Ally. I'd have 9 BP right now. Why on earth would I have done that? There's no way Clover would have chosen Ally when you had a chance to betray her and get to 9 BP. Are you an idiot or something? Bunch of smart asses. Luna has done nothing wrong. All right, Katie's setting us up here. Luna, Luna's Luna and Quark are all right. No risk of a penalty for her now. That brings Quark's BP up to nine. Are you worried that he might try and get out? Well, if he were to do so, the rest of us would be trapped here. Hmm. Bet you're all pretty happy he isn't here right now, aren't you? Yeah, I like Ten Miyoji. Yeah, maybe you aren't saying it. I know what you're thinking. The Ambidex gates have closed. Round three of the Ambidex game will be the star round. Star keys are required to open the gates. Yeah. There is no set limit on usage of the star keys. The Ambidex gates can be opened as many times as the players wish to open them. Oh, I missed him. So it would seem. And now the pup's back. All Where right, do we let's find see what them? happens here. Beyond the next set of chromatic doors. Oh? You found them already? Dog, we 
wishes to escape. You know, he seems fucking so. Seek a way out. White doors, huh? Maybe that's where Quark went. This this escape room has a real simple solution. You just the annoy Michael until he head? opens the door. <laughs> woof woof, Archie. <Archie. laughs> Shannon sent me a shriek today of her barking. And I don't know if I, I'm really on the edge of associating with her anymore. It, it was a real test. Damn. Real test the of the friendship the there, Shannon. Colors that can make white. Time we had a look at all our colors then. Yeah, you were barking at your dog. There were two dogs barking. And she just she just tagged it no context. I'm a magenta. Hair. Right. I'm a Libra. You and me, huh? Better than Dio, I guess. <laughs> Say something. What color are you? I'm a green solo. Oh. What's with the sun? Forget about it. I detect my ducks today. Cyan, pear. She was gonna I'm say I'm a magician for some reason. Alice and Luna's bracelets have changed as well. Oh, they're Both pear. Are yellow pears. That's unfortunate. Uh. He's a red solo. I'm sorry to hear you had such a traumatic day, Judy. You'd normally need, say, but I swear red, ducks are cool. And green. Solos can't group together, though, right? Together, That's why right? The pairs are magenta, yellow, and cyan. Magenta is a mix of red and blue. Oh, now it's playing cyberpunk. Okay then. We just need to get to the 4B warehouse when the doors open, right? Go straight for the ankles. Kick him in the face. Anywhere that isn't here. Hanging out with a murderer doesn't sound so, like a good time. Really. After today, would you prefer to fight a hundred duck-sized horses it. or one horse-sized duck? Well, then again, loners often turn out to be killers. Just what are you getting at, old man? You think I kill? going him? on their own, yeah. Well, maybe, maybe not. But you're pretty damn suspicious. You're trying to start something, you wrinkled old piece of. Hey, 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 knock it off now. We don't need no none when you have a do. We have no evidence of that, no. Duck sized do horses? Zero Senior is one of us. And there is an excellent chance that Zero Senior and the killer are one and the same. Well, we can't go through the doors without all nine people. So we're gonna have to find Quark before we go through a door. Find his bracelet. Well, the that would insinuate that he's dead, man. That's fucked up. I think it might be a good idea for us to all look for the killer. We also haven't found the bombs. Ooh. Well, we gain nothing by standing around here. Yeah. I've got to find Quark, and soon. If we're going to search, we should go in pairs this time. I'm more of a fan of apples. I'm not going with Kay. He decides he feels like snapping me in half. There's not a whole hell of a lot I can do about it. I'll go with anyone besides Dio. I don't want to go with Dio either. Can't wait for Shannon to redeem VIP choice, and me to just you. refund it. The hell! Just figured that this way we don't have to make this into a huge argument. Besides, I'm gonna be stuck with you once we go through the chromatic doors anyway. No reason to put it off. I will go with Sigma. Sigma what, bro? Would you prefer someone else? That leaves me and Clover as a pair then. Yep. We'll take the cyan door on floor A and the blue door on floor Please don't, B. I will cry. That's exactly why I'm going Clover to do and it. I'll take the magenta door and the red door. Uh, 
Got it. Wait. So why, why are these doors not white? Aren't these doors usually white? Oh no, we're, we're okay. We're on the first floor. We're just doing a full sweep of the place. You know, not those doors. Yeah, okay, I see now. Will I get my points back? Yeah, you get refunded, so yes. Because otherwise I, I could just ignore it. Why would I refund the VIP part and not the points? No cork and no killer as far as I can see. There is someone here. Technically yeah, dead lady. The old woman. Akane. She was lying silently on the bed furthest away from us. If it weren't for the blood stain on her chest and arm, her peaceful expression would have fooled most people into thinking she was just asleep. Do you think he's Santa, Tamioji Santa, and not Junpei? The blood had dried and darkened and now looked like another any other stain. Because, because Akane ran off with Santa. That was when I noticed it. Oh? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it seems remarkably my clear. lord. Somebody took her bracelet. Oh, my lord. Somebody's not supposed to be in this game. Oh. Oh. And it's someone with a bracelet, so it's not K. Maybe Who she is it, though? On her wrist. Why would Alice put herself watch, in the game? Perhaps. Yes. It was likely All right, Katie. she was killed. <laughs> That would account for the lack of blood spot Must be Luna. Rest. With a response like that, I think it's Luna. Psychoanalyzing Katie. Yeah, it's gotta be Luna. You she's dead? This bitch dead. Perhaps this is just a bitch we food. found. Alice got taken. Yeah, Alice did get taken. Luna or Dio? Yeah. Going around infecting the quarantine? Then that would mean... She was wearing a bracelet when she was killed! She was a participant, just like us. That sure? means there was another... That's this a third person that was supposed to be again. related to Ten Miyoji. Or did Sigma take oh, it? Oh, no. <gasps> nothing. If you're correct, then where did the thief hide the stolen bracelet? We were quite thorough during our earlier search. On their hands, stupid. Nothing, and none of the others reported finding a bracelet either. That would seem likely. So our suspect is not only a killer and a thief, but a skilled imposter as well. After killing the old woman, they put on her bracelet. In fact, it's entirely possible they are wearing Go on, still. make the joke. Yes, that would make sense. Yes. There's an imposter among us, there you go. Correct. Do you remember what Zero Junior told us? Something about how the bracelet will come off if the wearer's heart stops. I don't recall the exact words. But in any event, once the old woman had died, her bracelet would have detached, allowing the killer to easily collect it. So that they could Why? participate in the nonary game, I imagine. <gasps> I suspect the killer was someone who was not originally intended to be a participant. For whatever reason, however, they were willing to go to great lengths to ensure that they were. To that end, they killed the old woman 
who was one of the original participants, and took her place. That? Fucking Luna. I have no idea. Certainly they must have a goal of some sort. You would have to be mad to choose to come here. But as to what that goal is, and how the killer intends to but achieve... But the only time she gets killed is when we team up with Alice. That's why I think it's Alice. But now it doesn't make sense. Why would Alice sneak herself into the game? Have something? I'm just saying Luna because of my... Because of, cause of, cause of my psychoanalysis of... Of Katie. Oh. Right. Sigma. You're doing it because you, because the lady on the, the voice shared course, voice actresses. The, the lady on the video would walk shared voice with actresses with Luna. In blood. Yes. Have you discovered something? I don't really like going off of that. Should I send more ambiguous emojis for you to interpret? Uh, no, because oh, because I'll really listen. So far, I'm right. I know I'm right. I can just tell. You send more, it make it gets the risk of me being wrong. Aha! Uh -huh, I see. That could very well work. We should have everyone gather in the rec room then. That is where the Luminol was, I believe. She's the least problematic, though. Uh, yeah, that's fair. Um. It's just that's not your other reason. Your other reason was the voice actress. Understood. Which. Shall we go then? Could just be a coincidence. A coinky dink. I don't know who the killer is, but we need that for to get a key for another timeline. This timeline's fucked, alright? Luna's dead. Alice is dead. Quirk's gonna be dead. It's fucked, okay? Old lady's still alive in the original timeline. In the, in the one where we're like, The killer is you! Um... Well, no, they, they, the old lady isn't alive, she's just not found, we never found her corpse, which might build into Alice being innocent, because maybe Luna snuck off and hid the corpse properly in that timeline. The same as what we found on the other side of the blue door. She's not accounted for. Well, you said reasons, and then I said voice actors, and you said yes. So it does. Fuck you, Michael. You're the, the killer. The center and rightmost doors both say open. Perhaps the layout here. You is smart different. little fucking cunt, aren't you? You like being so right all the time, don't you? Oh shit, my earphone fell out. I'll be a killer if you keep acting like that, you son of a fucking bitch. I don't think they'd kill off Akane like that. Well, it's multiple timelines. I mean, she has been dead before. Can you guys hear the dog scratching at the door? That looks like a workbench of some sort. Oh, crafting bench! Gonna make myself a diamond pick. Very well. Or maybe in this scenario I'd do much better with a diamond hoe.
nothing. Yes. No, it was empty when I found it. Yes. I was thinking. Specifically, I was thinking about who opened this safe. No, that's unlikely. When we met up with Dio, he told us that he had been in the treatment center. The nameplate on this door says this is the Gollum Bay, however. I believe that is the case. Which, as you can see, is why I was puzzled. If Dio, Fi, and Clover did not open the safe, who did? What's happening? Did we find another bomb? Not another bomb. Yes, and there was another unlocked door, wasn't there? Mystery person opened the safe. Empty safe. What do you mean? Cool, great. Now that I have a banana, they show up. This is the room that Dio visited. Do you think Quirk did it as he was running amok? An excellent question. Kay and I split up and began to look for places where Quark might have hidden, or small holes where he might have escaped through. He already wants back up. They must be the treatment pods Dio mentioned. Shall we open it? No, they couldn't have lied because Dio had the cure. He had the gun. What? Hold on, Sigma. He's not do it. dead, oh, though. No. They froze him. Look at his chest. Can you see it moving? Because they froze him and they could take his bracelet off. I quickly pressed a finger to Cork's wrist. It was faint, but his heartbeat was still there. <sighs> what a relief. I'm so glad to know he's safe. I laughed out loud. No, oh, goddamn it! Wait, I'm gonna go back for that line. I laughed out loud and grabbed Kay in a bear hug, or at least as much as one, as much of one as I could imagine. He patted me on the back and shared what I thought might have been a relieved chuckle. But if he's still alive, why is his bracelet off? Perhaps Zero Senior took it off. Wait. Wait! Oh god, dogs. Jesus. In and out, and in and out. What time is it? We should finish up soon. We'll get to the next decision and then finish up there. He spat everywhere. Also, you're crooked.
This pod is for medical treatment. Perhaps Quark has contracted some sort of illness. I think the safes have always been How closed when we've returned to the rooms as well. In any event, we should return and let the rest of our companions know that we found Quark. So I think I unless they point out the fact that the safe's closed and hasn't been open, uh, we shouldn't use that as, as evidence. No, I believe it would be best to leave Quark here. As I mentioned, there is a chance he has fallen ill. If so, then removing him from the pod would be dangerous. The treatment he is currently undergoing could be compromised. I'll close the pod's cover then. Is that all right? Quark wasn't murdered though, so they weren't taken, most likely weren't taken by the same person. What do you mean? He'll be fine. I noticed a lever inside that can be used to open the cover. So long as no one locks the pot, he should be able to leave whenever he wants. Yes, that is what I said. Oh, Shannon's right there. But you needn't worry. Yeah, no. Cork had nine. You see? I have not engaged the lock. Now, we should return to the Floor B warehouse. I imagine the others are already there. Well, everybody went in pairs, so someone would have to be dead. Late. You're one to talk. How much earlier did you get back again? I'd be surprised if you searched at all. Yeah, Clover and Tenmyoji still aren't back. So, so it must be one of them. Tenmyoji yeah. wouldn't leave his grandson behind, it. though, right? I explained to them how we find Quark in the treatment center. Also, can you escape if you're still wearing one that doesn't have a nine? I see. Do you think someone well, just took it so, uh, jerk, Make so that Quark worried. couldn't escape? There is more. And that is? There is still some cause for concern. Just spit it out. Quark may have contracted an illness of some sort. As such, he has been left in the treatment pod. Will he be all right? As in the uh, Accelerator? Probably. Do you even. Whatever. At least we found him. Pretty lucky he's alive, too. What do you mean by that? I mean what I said, genius. I'm glad he's not dead, aren't you? As equivocal as ever, I see. How kind of you to say so. Yeah, but without the bracelet, so he can't open the found? door. The way you were talking, the injection gun, like we don't have else. the accelerator. No, we did. Um, Dio find it. But uh, I think we just left it there with Luna. I don't know if someone took it. There's something I wanted to ask you about first. Dio took it and tried to hide it. That's not the accelerator. They were in the room with the Dio? accelerator. No, just the treatment center. Isn't that the... Oh no, it's a different room. I was thinking the treatment center was... It's what do you mean, the other one? Yeah, no way. I got my rooms mixed up. I dare you, Elida. Celevere was in the lab. Yeah, I, I forgot. So many labs and, like, treatment centers and... And, and the, uh... What's the, uh... The one that people usually pass out? The infirmary? Who could have opened it? Don't look at me. I told you, we only opened the one that went to the treatment center. Could it have been zero zero? If it's a sedative, then, do you think... Hmm. Or an anti-sedative? So did you and Kay go through the other door? What was in there? It appears so to what, be did, some sort what did of Luna get injected with then? Something. That doesn't make any sense. 
So what the hell was whoever opened that door? Surely the anti-sedative wouldn't have knocked her out, right? Tim Miyoji and Clover are running rather late. Should we go and look for them? It's never easy with you, is it? Not with an injection. Let's get it over no. with. It's gotta be like good enough to inject into your like veins. It's what they do in all the movies, you know? Huh. Well, back this in the lads' the room. room. Lads Dio room. and I came here earlier when we were looking for Quark. Oh yeah? So why are we here? Oh, because we're gonna spray them. To see? We're gonna test who's the murderer. I said nothing and instead made my way over toward the cabinet. Inside was the luminol. I reached in and pulled it out, then headed to the light switch and flipped it. Might have punctured her windpipe. I think that's a real, like, awkward kill. The room went dark and headed back to where the others were still standing. Whoa, whoa, what is this? You gonna start telling ghost stories or something? Were they severed an artery or something? <laughs> I don't think so. You're kidding me, right? Bracelets? What do you mean by that? Yeah, I think I think she got injected with something. And I don't know how the anti-sedative might work, but she might still be alive. It might be something that just like makes her heart stop beating, so the thing fell off, but then she wakes up. Like the first thing that injects you into mean. you from the bracelet. What I'm asking is what the hell you think you're But I don't think that makes sense. That's why I didn't say it. Should I also participate? It's just you guys are giving off your crazy theory, so I may as well throw mine out there. Yeah, your bracelet's different. It's not a bracelet, it's kind of part of a suit, Iron Man. There was a brief moment of hesitation before Dio and Fi stuck out their arms. Good moment. I held out mine as well. This okay? Great scene that is from the thing Ben's referencing. If you don't know it, do yourself a favor and watch it. As fast as I could, I pulled the luminol from my pockets and sprayed it across all three of her wrists. Ugh. Cold. What the hell, man? Dio jerked his arm back with a shot. See anything glowing? Ice bracelet is clean. That leaves only Dio. Wait, what are you talking about? I'll explain in a minute. Just show me your damn bracelet. Just show it to me. Come on, Dio. Mine's isn't gonna be bigger. Don't worry. Why do I have to do what you tell me to? I'm trying to prove your innocence. Oh, like hell you are. I don't know what you're looking for, but you're not gonna find it on me. Just show me your goddamn arm. No, you don't get to order me around. I have rights. As he spoke, Dio made a break for the exit. He didn't get far. I'm afraid I can't let you do that, Dio. <laughs> Just crushes his skull. Now that he's dead, check his bracelet. He spun around towards the other exit. Stop! Right. Stop him! Don't know what you're talking about, but okay. Compare Cox? Well, no. <laughs> Unless. Oh, is this gonna be him on the- Whoa, whoa, animation? His bracelet's glowing. That means... Let me go! Okay, what Get are you doing to him? Fuckers. That looked inappropriate. Killed the old lady. No! You don't understand. This is all some kind of... A mistake. Shit. 
What's going on here? I think it's about time you gave us the full story. <sighs> hip, 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 hip. So the person with the bloody bracelet would have to be the person who killed her. I don't know if it is. Because we couldn't see arms holding Dio down. Could we? Also, well, I guess it was black and white. We've got you, Dio. Might as well confess. Well? <laughs> Alright, fine. You caught me. I did it. I killed the old bitch and took her bracelet. Are you Zero? No. I was under orders. I was sent here to... He is a terrorist! Something. He's one of the terrorists. Who gave you this order? I'll die before I tell you. I didn't well, let's kill get them. ahead of ourselves. Huh? I killed the old lady, but that's it. I don't know anything about what happened to Alice and Luna. Tread carefully, Sigma. This Sigma man Walker? is not to be trusted. He has already shown he is willing to lie and kill. Take his hat off. I'm telling the truth. You gotta believe me. Just because fuck if him. I do believe you. You're still a killer. You just haven't killed as many people. Exactly. He should be restrained somehow. If we leave him be, he may well kill again. Is there a room we can lock or anything? Ah, perhaps we could put him in one of the treatment pods. Once we've locked it, he should be unable to escape. Hey, wait. Man, this timeline's really I'll be good. I, I sectioning promise. everybody off. Come on, please. Hey, listen to me. Don't fuck with me, you guys. There's no way in hell I'm going in that thing. Let go! Let me go! God damn it! God damn it! You assholes, so let me go! You can't do this! Stop! Stop! Please you mean stop. Clover and Ten Miyogis? No, you can't! Thing. No. I said open it, god damn it. And I said no, god damn it. Uh, you're gonna pay for this. If I get out of here, I'm gonna fucking end you. <laughs> no kill. What a shame. Now all that's left to do is find Clover and Tenmyoji. Why don't we head back to the warehouse and start from there? They may have already returned. Let's go. Man, it really sucks. This timeline with K where we're like, you fucked this over. Because we're being real good pals now. But we know deep down that he's a cunt. Bet they're dead too. I don't think they're both going to be dead. Memento Mori in the ninth lion something something. Looks like they aren't back yet. Perhaps they went to look for us. Need the man's bracelet. Oh, I don't think we're going to get that far. How much the white doors open? 50 minutes? I don't think we're gonna get that then far. I don't think we really need to hurry yet. Why don't we wait a little longer? For all we know, they're on their way back right now. Why don't we just meet them halfway? Like, go the path they went. By the way, there was something I wanted to ask you guys about. Six inches. S yeah. Exactly. Quark's bracelet. 
When we found him in the pod, he wasn't wearing it. Why? Presumably, it had been taken off before we found him. So we have no idea where it is. I see. That's not good. Without that bracelet, we won't be able to continue the game. We need three bracelets to open the secondary door. If we lose one... <laughs> That's a good point. Well, yeah, we showed him off, didn't we? Yeah. I think we showed him off. Cork's bracelet should be a red solo. That would mean he'd be with the cyan pair. Are they all the dead folks? Clover and Tenmyoji. Oh, no, the two not. people who are missing. Quark's bracelet is gone, and his two teammates have disappeared. <laughs> What's going up to... No, they couldn't have already gone through the door. Well, if they found Quark before you did, yeah, there's a good chance they did. Perhaps they've already gone through the white door. No. They can't, because the time's not up. Right? Yeah. Perhaps someone opened one of them. I don't know. But it's happened before. Remember the three doors on the other side of the green door? Someone made one of them open. Perhaps this is the same thing. Yes, I know. But if the person opening the doors is Zero Senior, do you really think the rules matter? Zero Senior controls the entire game. So are you saying Clover or Tenmyoji is Zero Senior? It is a possibility. It would explain why they still haven't shown up. Could they really have taken Quark's bracelet and gone through one of the white doors? So I would assume. Okay. I'll stay. Sigma and I will go see if we can find them then. Make sure you get back five minutes before the door opens, all right? Oh, and don't forget to bring Dio with you. We're gonna find out what that mystery item is in another timeline. Me and my best friend Sigma. Sigma what, dude? And then you have the cat laughter play. Going into the pantry is where they keep the pants. Where are all them pants at? But a bum bum bum. So it would appear. Looks like they're not here. When we started looking for Quark, they were sent off to search everything beyond the red door. Which would have meant this room. They must have gone through this room. Not gonna do us any good to hang around here, though. Let's head upstairs. Very well. What's annoying is sometimes it stops at those arrows and shows us opening the one-way door, and other times it just doesn't. Inconsistency kills me deep down.
Well, you don't, you don't know Tamioji that much. We should go all night playing this. Only the fucking killer would decide to end his stream soon. Uh, it was, it was around that time that I noticed Kay was acting strangely. He was staring at the shelf of alcohol in a way that I probably would have described as blankly if I could have actually seen his eyes. I was actually planning on doing something else after this stream, so I was encouraged to end early. But they just cancelled, so... If people want to go another hour, we can. Oh, no. Well, I would enjoy a drink, but this mask... I assume that's what Connor's insinuating. Nah, Ben, you're still on. Uh, honestly, I'd gotten so used to the suit, I'd kind of forgotten you were wearing it. Gonna head soon anyway. Well, can't go without cutie. Why the heck did they make you wear that thing anyway? You still don't remember anything. Well, actually, I... I did remember... A little. Yes. Are we about to get a fucking novel from Kay? My father. This must be the Kay ending. When... Oh, Please, God. don't joke. This I is thought serious. that was just a, a, a grammatical error. So you remember who your father was? Yes. Uh. I... Don't seem to have one. I. So your dad raised oh. you? Here we go. Kay stopped for a moment, then calmly folded his hands in front of him. I was raised in the facility where my father worked. He was the oh. only person who worked there. Which Look meant he was that. the only person I saw until I was older. Look at that man. That had been the situation for as long as I could remember, though. So I never thought it odd. He wouldn't allow me to go near him while he was working. Oh, sorry, this is robot. He wouldn't allow me to go near him while he was working. The only times he wasn't working were the times when he was sleeping. Tamioji soon. I don't think so. Maybe. But I don't think so. As such, the only communication I had with, I had, was with the education software he'd given me. I suppose I was a fairly expressionless child then. We developed body language to meet, communicate with each other, and with no one else to communicate with, I suppose it makes sense. All right, Shannon, why are you laughing at him? Once I learned to read and write, I began to realize that my situation was not normal. Normal. Probably how he would have said it. Many of my books mentioned a mother as part of a family, and in several, the mother, father, and children would eat meals together and talk to one another. Soon I found myself longing for a mother of my own. Someone who would always be with me, who, who would scold me if I did something wrong. At night, they would read to me before bedtime. If only I had a mother like that, I thought, I would be so happy. That ruins my theory. He's grown up quirk, my head's gonna blow. So for the first time in my life, I asked my father for something. He had finished working, and as usual, was making his way towards his bedroom when I stopped him and asked for a mother. He looked at me silently for a long moment before finally responding. Okay! <laughs> I remember to this day how happy I was at that moment. A few months later, he called me into his laboratory. It was the first time he'd ever done anything like that. My heart was beating quickly as I stepped inside. Standing next to him was a young woman. My hopes soared. Right. Sam has come in for the novel reading. What did Ben say? That's a big titty fef fem dom mommy. No kink shaming. Is there a fucking shit kink, Ben? No, fuck that shit. Shannon, you sound like the type of person that would like that. <laughs> but when he said her name, or rather, her ID number, they were, they were dashed. 
Oh, his teddy's all torn up now. He had given me a robot to play the part of a mother. I didn't want a mother that was just a machine who did what a human told her to. When I told my father that he looked that, he looked surprised for the first time in my life. Then he frowned, coughed, and admonished me for being a, a whiner. <laughs> Jesus. Sounds by the man. He never scolded me for anything before. At first I was surprised, then angry. Hot tears streamed down my face. My father ordered the robot to take care of me and shoot us out of his lab. The robot was very convincing and she smiled and spoke as if she was a real person, but I refused to answer her and locked myself in my room. So his dad's definitely gonna be zero, right? You can talk to a robot and it will respond, but in the end, you're still talking to a machine, not a person. If that was what I'd wanted, I still had the education software my, my father had given me. When I ignored the robot as it tried to take care of me, it looked sad. It couldn't really be sad, of course. It was only programmed to look that way. A robot's facade of sadness didn't mean anything to me. Sigma son? Mommy and daddy titties freak me the fuck out. What do you mean? What important rule. Don't get me wrong, I like a fandom, but a mommy no thanks. I'm confused. After that, I stopped expecting anything from my father. We'd never really spoken to begin with, so it was easy enough for me to make sure we never saw one another. I lived my life as if it didn't, as if he didn't even exist. Perhaps it seems strange to you that I continued to live with him, but I never considered leaving. Perhaps in the hidden depths of my heart, I longed for a relationship with my father. Everything changed when I was 18. I left my room one morning to find a woman standing outside of it. She was the first human I'd ever seen, apart from my father, and I was understandably surprised. For a moment, I thought my father had created a new robot, but when I told her that, she laughed and explained that she had come to help him. As it turned out, she was a very mysterious person. She was much older than I, but something about the way she behaved was almost girlish. She would tell me stories about the world outside in such a way that I was never sure if she was telling the truth or making up fantastic lies. Ultimately though, the truth didn't matter. I loved her stories. She wasn't helping my father directly with his research, so I spent most of my, my days with her. My doys. Spent most of my doys with her. Before long, I discovered she'd known my father when he was young. She told me stories of how he'd fallen in love as a younger man, and I began to imagine that the person he'd fallen in love with had been her, and that she was, in fact, secretly my mother. It all changed when the Fire Nation attacked. If zero equals future Sigma, then yes, Sigma son. Sig Sigma, Sigma what, bro? Titles, Michael. Titles, not titties. Oh. Kane, Fire Nation bitches, jumpy. <laughs> you guys are all over the place, you silly billies. After she settled in with us, our long established routine began to change drastically. First, we started to eat together. Before then, I had never shared a meal with anyone in 18 years. She scolded me for my table manners, or more accurately, the lack thereof. If I was going to eat with others, she said, I would need to be more polite. Having eaten alone for my entire life, manners had been something I'd never even thought about. My father got in trouble too when he made the mistake of reading through research papers during dinner. The look of surprise and embarrassment on his face made me burst in laughter. If it's Junpei, what's he researching? And if it's not Junpei, who is he? Who else fell in love? I couldn't remember the last time I'd shared a laugh with my father. It might have been the first time. 
The room we considered our living room changed too. Before it had just been another room, but she made it comfortable. After we finished our dinner, I would sit on the sofa and relax with her and my father. Those times were the ones I cherished the most. For a little while, every day I got the family I'd longed for, ever since I was a child. That's, uh, that's the, that's the lab room. At her suggestion, I started to help with my father's research. He specialized in genetic engineering, and I discovered I had an interest in it as well. Time faded away as I lost myself in research. Now that we were working together and studying together, my father and I had a great deal to talk about. Is Kay just a robot? For the first time in my life, we began to speak with one another like father and son. Whenever I impressed him with something, I'd learned I felt the surge of happiness and it drove me to study even harder. My days felt full, right, and meaningful, and most importantly, I was happy. Okay, well, there's your confirmation it's Zero and, and the old lady. Four years passed in the blink of an eye, until one day I happened to overhear my father and the woman speaking in the laboratory. Oh, yeah, he might be a robot program. That's zero. Yeah, that is zero. And that's the old lady. Um, do you think it's actually Snake? Not Snake. Santa and Akane and Tamiyoji is Junpei. Show me robot hand. Their tone was serious, so I listened closer, curious to know what they were talking about. That was when I heard her say that she planned to give her life to achieve their goals. <coughs> Sorry. It was clear that she wasn't being metaphorical. She would have had to die. I was in shock. The research I'd thrown myself into would lead to her death? I asked my father to stop his research immediately. He refused to listen. She agreed with him. She told me that she had been prepared for what she had to do since the day she came into our facility. My father had known about it from the beginning as well. Angry and disappointed, I began to investigate what exactly the research I'd been helping with was working toward. <laughs> Termites. Perhaps I thought I could figure out a way to keep her alive. I discovered much more than I'd bargained for. To begin with, I learned that the ultimate success of my father's research would require a good deal of sacrifice. And I also learned that my own existence was just another part of his project. Dear mates. Specifics, please. I had been created to function as my father's spare. If he died during his research, I was intended to continue it in his place. I was stunned. I was furious with my father and with her, and even with the research I'd poured myself into for four years. There was only one thing to do. Destroy the facility and end my father's horrible research once and for all. I made plans to destroy the main reactor and with it, the entire facility. Is he the one planting bombs? No, Ben, but you saw right through me. My father was livid and locked me in my room until his research was complete. All I could think of was how I might stop him. She did her best to convince me that I would misunderstood it, that everything would be fine. Why else would they gray her out if she wasn't relevant? As much as I wanted to believe her, I remembered in the back of my mind that she had been the one who pushed me to become involved in my father's research. Had that been my, an earnest desire to give something to do with my life? Or... Still, I couldn't bring myself to hate her. She had given me such good head, I mean a reason to live. Even if she had conspired with my father to mold me into his replacement, the warmth she'd shown me had been real. She'd made me feel as if I had a real Bruh. family. Excuse you, Ben. And that was something I wouldn't have given up for the world. I pleaded with her to leave. She quietly shook her head. There was someone very special to her, she told me. He had saved her life once, and she felt her death would help to repay that favor. Yeah, okay, so it's definitely Akane. She's talking about Junpei. It's happening again. Fuck. You bastard. Alright. Oh, <laughs> uh, oops. 
She would have liked nothing more than to marry him and live a happy, normal life together. But she couldn't, for his sake, she said, and for the sake of the future she had wanted. She was determined to see my father's research succeed. Has to be a kind. Yeah, that adds, adds up. So, so Zero must be Santa, and Temioji is Junpei. What's this time travel shit? Why are we so, why is Clover still young? What the fuck's going on? I realized then that although she was the most important person in my life, there was someone more important than me and hers. Zero must be Junpei. I don't think so. Uh, she tried to ex what, Junpei wouldn't let Akane die, is the thing. Maybe Sando wouldn't either. Uh, she tried to explain that beyond what we could see was a future where no one would have, would have to die, but I refused to listen. What good was a potential future to me? It was, it was what I had now that I wanted. No, she wanted to marry someone else, not Zero. Didn't she ask someone to marry him? No, no, no. That there was someone that she wished she could marry and live a normal life. I couldn't stand to think that she would give her life for a man I'd never even seen. Let's see. Uh. There's so much. Look at all this fucking shit we just went through, by the way. I can't find it. Exposition. So I shut myself off from the world. Perhaps that's why I lost my memory. Bruh. Ow. Bro, you had it and you just started scrolling. I mean, obviously I had it when I fucking scrolled through everything, Bane. But I, point, I just pointed out that I can't fucking see it. You saw it. You get the point. Die! Uh, Kay let out a deep, tired sigh. <sighs> that was too real, I'm sorry. I lost track of time. Not having any memories is less than desirable, but it could be argued that regaining them is almost more taxing. Santa might be no, zero. I don't think Santa zero. would want to let... Akane die either, though, would Especially he? Especially more recent events. <laughs> um, Sigma, I'm sorry, but would it be all right if I laid down for a bit? I don't feel very well. It must be because I remembered so much so quickly. My head feels like it's going to explode. And then it did. Yes. The whole reason we had the I first nunner again is because Santa wouldn't let her die. Exactly. Unless there's a bigger reason. Oh, you think radical? I was thinking maybe I'm the sorry. sedative kicked in and he's dying, but... Maybe radical. Kay lowered himself heavily onto the red sofa in the corner, off the rim. Oh, well, no, because the year still doesn't make sense. Like, we'd all have had to have been put in there at that time, right? Because Sigma is also from 2028. I stepped out of the room and nearly ran into Phi. Unless it's the three of them, but I'm pretty sure we've had an encounter with someone else where we're like, this is the date, right? And they're like, yeah. I just decided to go check on you guys. But maybe every, I know one of the interactions was with Alice. So maybe every time Judging we've mentioned the face, date, we've been with Alice either. and Clover. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. He's in the lounge, he's just lounging about. Split up? Do they have the right day? I can't remember anyone else having the right day, but I just assumed we had. Instead of waiting for my answer, she opened the door to the lounge and walked in. In front of them, okay. Talking What's about the eclipse. Him? Yeah, that was in front of Dio, wasn't it? Guess he's not feeling too well. He said he wanted to rest for a bit. Is he alright? I mean, he's a robot, but whatever. Wow, 
Well, we don't know that. Tired, huh? Was the lunar eclipse How not in this feeling? room? It was in this room, and it was Alice and Dio that were looking at you. Your face is like a weak old sock. All right, bitch. I'm talking about weak old socks here. What's that between your legs? But everything here makes absolutely zero sense. <gasps> zero! Bad guy. The more I try to figure any of it out, uh, the more I feel like uh, my brain's just gonna melt and uh, run out of my ears. Uh, you know what I'm talking about, right? I managed to figure out who the killer was, but there's still a hundred other questions we have no idea about. Man, this one's dragging on. I'm going till the end of this one, unless we get a choice. Um, in which case, I'm going to the choice. Guy with good motives, but bad execution. <sighs> what about how is zero? No, it can't be Dio. Can't be K. Can't be Alice. Not Alice. Can't be Clover, I mean. Could be Alice. Probably isn't Ten Miyoji? No, wait. We've seen Zero. Never mind. Is it Future Us? I swear, if they manage to explain this game Are you serious? without any time you can't travel, suspect me, can you? Fuck this game. I'm just like you. I was kidnapped on December 25th. That's true. Brought here too. Oh. Well, what year? <sighs> uh, you heard that, yeah. right? It came from the hallway. <laughs> Did you have a look? There's nobody here. Maybe they got on the elevator. Let's try hitting the button. If the door doesn't open immediately, then we'll know the elevator's downstairs. They, they use that logic now? I got a piece of hair in my nose, but I don't want to pull it out because it'll look like I'm picking my nose. <laughs> but it tickles. Thought so. I've tried to use that logic previously when searching for Alice, and they did not. They did not abide by that. No, no, no. Inconsistency. Which way? Where do you think they went? Let's just head for the green door. Because the treatment center's there. That's where Dio and Quark are. <laughs> you aren't worried? I just want to make sure they're safe. Do you think that wasn't actually the K ending? Because we got a big exposition dump from Alice before, and it wasn't an Alice ending. Are you sure? Dio admitted to killing the old woman, but he still insists that he didn't kill Alice or Luna. What if he's telling the truth? Luna might be alive. Doesn't matter. I just want to know if they're safe. No harm in being careful. The K... No, I was going to say the K ending has to be when he reveals who he is. But that's probably along the true ending. Like, that's probably way towards the end of the game. We 
headed to the first pond. I cracked open the top and lifted it back. There was Quark, signed to sleep. Yeah, I guess you're right. I was probably getting worried for nothing. Nurses, Ben. Nurse. She's a nurse, isn't How she? How Dio? Why would we open his? Just knock. He's gonna be gone then. But he's dead. Check his pulse. Ew, no, no. It was pointless to check his pulse. He was obviously dead. But I did it anyway. She's a doctor? No, silly. Women can't be doctors. Women are nurses. Look, the oxygen level for his pod says zero percent. That means he is asphyxiated, okay? I'm not stupid. Oxygen levels. Look, we should go tell Kay about this. No, we didn't. Did we do it? Come on. Someone Let's else go. did. They're waiting for me to follow. Fight turned and ran off. I took a deep breath and followed. It could also be K. So K, Phi, Alice, not Alice. K, Phi, Clover, Tenmyoji, Luna. That's five. Something's happened. He's dead too. When he didn't move, I grabbed him by the shoulders and shook. We were with him the whole time. Yeah, but he might have done it as we were leaving. Uh, he twitched and quickly sat up. He's not dead. What? What is it? We explained about how we'd find Dio dead, and how it looked like he died of as 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 asphyxiation. Appeared that someone had reduced the oxygen level of his pod to zero. Everyone is dying. What? But why? I thought that Dio was the one who killed the old woman, Alice, and Luna. Then who killed him if he was the murderer? No, no. There's also asphyxiation. As 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 asphyxiation. Yeah, I don't think Cork did it. No, I'm just saying that strictly speaking, it's a possibility. So just, you know, take it into consideration. Well, in that case, Phi, I hate to say it, but doesn't that mean that you could have done it? Me? Yes. You could have done it any time after Sigma and I left the 4B warehouse. Don't give me that. I was waiting for Clover and Tenmyoji to show up. They never did, though, so I got impatient and went to find you guys. Then I bumped into Sigma in front of the lounge. Well, Dio's bracelet was in with him, wasn't it? Well, the old lady's bracelet. She went on to explain about the sound we'd heard. I see. So you heard something. But then perhaps it is likely that Clover and Tenmyoji were at fault. Were the two of you together the whole time you were investigating? Yes, yeah, it was we like were. right next to his head. You he looked like a dead anything. spider. Hmm. In any event, we don't have a great deal of time to discuss it. I mean, it might be Kay. Or Phi. One of them could have done it as we were leaving. Alright. Let's get back to the Floor B warehouse. Maybe Clover and Tenmyoji are already there. Oh. But where is Dio's bracelet? Huh? You didn't take it? Dio was a green solo. That's true. Phi and I are the magenta pair. Shit. You're right. Without Dio's bracelet, we won't be able to open the secondary door. I fear not. 
Then we need to hurry. If the bracelet's gone, then I don't think it was one of these three. Also, that blunder by Phi, I don't think it was her. This hair is really is annoying. Need to go. <clears throat> you two go on ahead. I'll get the bracelet. All right. Oh, one other thing. I need to give you these. Yes. Without these, you would be stuck. So, here you are. Please. Thank you, Brett. I grab the bracelets and shove them in my pocket. All right, let's get going. Just the two of us. She, do not hear. Maybe they did go through the door, like Kay said. Or. Or what, stupid? Oh, come on, man. You better not give me that. Maybe they're already dead, crap. I don't know if you do. Well, it is a possibility, she's gonna say. You gotta be kidding me. If you're right, then you, Kay, Quirk, and I are the only people still alive in here. Hey, lay off. I want to believe they're alive, too. But... We heard a noise and turned. It's gonna be Kay. Santa? I apologize oh. for keeping you. Did you get Dia's bracelet? Well, technically, yes, but... Huh? Best you just see it. This is it's what I broken? found in Dio's pod. What? Jingles, yay. I assume whoever murdered Dio did this. But why? There's no point. I can't say for sure. But if I were to guess... Who's to stop us? Chromatic doors have opened. Five minutes remain until chromatic doors close. With a bracelet like this, I doubt we can get past the secondary door. That means Kay and I will... Oh no, shit. You're a... When the time comes, You're those gonna... three doors will automatically close. Anyone is left outside after they close, they'll... They'll be penalized. You're gonna get pe penalized, I, I see. Know. That's what they wanted. Whoever killed Dio wanted to use the game to kill me and Kay. That's why they broke the bracelet. I think so. It makes the most <laughs> sense. Some sick fucko put Dio near... near Quark, so we killed him. Go on ahead, Sigma. Sigma what, You have those bracelets Kay gave you, right? You should be able to get through the secondary door with those. So just... No, fuck that! You know I can't ditch you guys like that! But if you stay here, you'll... You think I don't know that? What kind of monster am I if I just leave you here to die? God damn it. This was bad. What was I going to do? I needed to calm down. Just calm down. Calm down and think. There had to be a way to save them. There had... Oh! <laughs> Needles hop out and inject you. 
My brother told me about that. Neostigmine is a type of cholinesterase inhibitor. That means it's sort of an antidote for tubocurine. Fuck you, call me? I knew it. Get back. I found yeah, this you're dead. To each according to his needle is the achievement I got. Of course, the antidote. the antidote. I didn't have time to explain. I took off running toward the exit. Whoa! Oh! Sigma! Sigma, what, bro? I'll be right back, dollface. I bolted out of the warehouse towards the treatment room. Better not be dead when we get back. All right, wait a minute. I can't. Oh, because my controller's dead. I was wondering why the buttons were working. All right, wait a bit. We're gonna leave it there for tonight. That's an exciting conclusion, but uh, it looks like it's gonna take another bit to get to an ending. So uh, no thanks. At least we got a lock. That was lock number one. I couldn't find in KV saved. Cliffhanger ending. Yeah, that's uh. I mean, we got progress, Dan. We didn't get an ending tonight, which is. Sickening. Um, I really hope we hit a point where it's just like ending, 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 ending. But we very mel well may not. So, uh, yeah, tune in tomorrow. You know the time. Uh, once we get all the locks popped. Uh, stop you talking about popping. Um, no Facebook. I don't want to be friends with Tara. Um, yeah, I'm not going to raid anyone. It's too late. You guys are all going to go to sleep. Uh, so, uh... What was that? That's click. Rude. I'm immune, though. I'm immune to your fat clit, Shannon. Ehoi. Good night.